Hello, everyone, and welcome to Tip of the Hat 2015. It's been a long time in the making here, but we finally done it. We are live now from the Ignite Gaming Lounge here in Chicago, and I'm just so happy. Could not be more excited. Very quickly, here to my right, I am being joined by none other than Alex Seabear Isaac and Justin Bloodsire Danford. How are you guys doing? What's up, guys? How's it going? Just drove in here from Minnesota. Stopped in Madison, Wisconsin, and it is quite the show here, man. We have this room full of TF2 people. I've never met any of them. <laughs> First time meeting my boy Justin Lang I've met before, but it's like Briefly. a fresh experience. It's yeah. great. We're going to have a great 36-hour stream. We're live in person this year, and it's going to be ex ac absolutely exciting. And just glad to meet everyone and to get the show on the road. Yeah, so uh, as Seabear said, we are going to be live for about uh, 36 hours here. We have all kinds of stuff coming up. It's crazy. I don't know how we fit all this in here. Uh, none of us can believe it, but we somehow have done it. Sea bear. Yeah. Um, so, of course, first off, we're here raising money for One Step Camp. That is Children's Oncology Services, Inc. Real quickly, they just uh, they put on camp programs for kids going through cancer treatment and their families as well. So it's a real great cause. We're going to talk a little bit more about that in a couple minutes here. But I just yeah. want to give a quick run through of the event, just let you guys know what you can expect here. Uh, we got a whole lot coming up. Um, we're going to have competitive segments. we got NA versus EU. We're going to have that classic uh, show-off across the ocean once again. We're going to have uh, MGE tournaments. We're going to have all kinds of fun pub sections with wacky mods going on. We're going to have jumping, surfing, all that stuff. Uh, what else we got coming up there, Bloodsire? Well, we're going to kick it off right away with a, a short video about One Step so you guys get um, a sense of, of sort of what actually goes on at this camp, which you're right. raising money for. Um, and then we're going we're gonna to sit down and talk to the, uh, wh what is his title? It, the, uh, the president. The president of, the, the, of, the, of Children's Oncology. He's actually going to sit here. We're going to ask some questions so you guys and gals who are donating actually get to know um, right from the source where your money's going. And, and it's a great cause, and, and he'll help us break it down. But. Yeah, um, but real quick before we jump into that video, I uh, just want to say a little bit more about the event here. Um, the donation tracker uh, is the same as uh, the Games Done Quick donation tracker. So if you just head on over to uh, tracker.tipofthehats.org or tipofthehats.org slash donate, you can head over there and get your donations in. And we have all kinds of awesome raffles and bid challenges you can enter. Um, all sorts of donation incentives for you. Uh, check out all those raffles for sure. You can see the total up there in the other corner. This is difficult, see Bear broadcasting, with the uh, donations coming in as they're happening. Um, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and uh, introduce these players over here that we have with us, uh, playing over in the server. We have Mela with us, we have Admirable, <laughs> we have Tag, and we have Getaway. And that was Young Truck Truck as well in the corner there, just helping people get set up. Uh, all sorts of last minute prep happening, you know how these events are. <laughs> and yeah, they're, uh, they're in a pub. They're, uh, they're playing around, having some fun, or they're trying to get into the pub. We might be having some problems with that, but that's okay, because we're real good at talking here, Sea Bear. Yeah, I don't see any TF2 from yeah. my angle. I see, I see Mayla <laughs> struggling. On the other angle. He's riding the struggle bus. Yeah, we got the server there. The it's starting to fill up. If hey. you guys want to go ahead and join that pub, I believe that in our Twitch chat, if you type exclamation point pub, you can get the information for that. That's uh, fantastic. We'll they're, not, they're not letting us play. They're not letting He's us play. He's too good, not too bad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, it's been a while. <laughs> uh, we also have a subscriber on our Twitch TV channel. Uh, we have all sorts of great emotes that Jazzbutts uh, designed for us. She's the one who did the art for those. Uh, so if you go ahead and want to subscribe to our channel, uh, we can start unlocking more of those emotes. I think we only have two of the emotes unlocked right now, yeah. but we have, I think, eight designed. So as we continue to get more subs, we're going to be unlocking those emotes, pushing them through approval as quickly as we can so you guys can start using those and having fun. And those are fantastic. They I've they seen they them, and they're great. Yeah. They're awesome. They're really I think they're just right there on the bottom of the stream. Yep, you guys they're, look. they're down there in our Twitch info section if you want to check them Absolutely. out. Absolutely. There's one of Lang's face. I don't know if that one's unlocked yet. Uh, I think that's like 100 subscribers. I don't know <laughs> if that's worth it, but it's definitely <laughs> we can do this. Subscribe. Let's <laughs> That's get there. what we got. It's there. <laughs> um, yeah, we also have our, our tipped lid, which was the hat that we got put in the game last year. Uh, Rusky Dew is the one who uh, modeled and textured that hat. It's uh, very similar to this. If we want to go to a uh, camera here, we have a little tip lid here. And some, some Review, I'm re revealing it. some <laughs> dirty production secrets to make this possible, but that's okay. Don't want to ruin the magic too much. I'll go ahead and yeah. <laughs> put that back right there. The rabbit's coming out of there later. <laughs> yeah, and uh, of course, the last big thing we got here that I do want to tell you about before we uh, jump into the event, or uh, the video rather, is uh, we have the jaunty pin, who also was uh, made by Rusky Doo. I call the pin a who. Was yeah. made by Rusky Doo. Um, and if you donate at least $20 USD cumulative throughout this event, it doesn't have to be in one donation. You can spread it across multiple ones. Uh, so if you donate at least $20 USD to our tracker, uh, you will become eligible to get that jaunty pin. And we'll be giving those out after the event. There's a manual process involved. Some might take a little bit, but rest assured that after the event, we'll be uh, ditching, ditching? Dishing those out. Dishing them out. Dishing them out. Deal them out like a deck of cards. <laughs> Just dealing them out here. Make them rain. Those uh, <laughs> pins. To our donors. So uh, 
yeah, we got the pub firing up. People are starting to join, but I think uh, without any further ado, we're going to go ahead and throw it over into a quick one-step video so you guys can learn uh, a little bit more about the camp and why it is that we're doing this. Children Oncology Services offers programs for kids with cancer and cancer survivors. Despite their diagnosis, it helps them enjoy their childhood. Uh, the summer camp, the oldest and largest program, is held in Lake Geneva, Wisconsin. Uh, my name is Chris. I, uh, my name is 26 years old. I've been involved with camp since 2006. The first program I went on was a ski trip in Utah. Whether it was summer camp, winter camp, dude ranch, Washington DC, there's so many different opportunities available to you. So when I was seven years old, I just developed a cough. They realized I had cancer in my ribs, a type of bone cancer. I'm Maya. I'm 12 years old, and I was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia. And sometimes it makes things harder for me. It makes me tired. I was diagnosed with a spinal cord tumor at the age of five, which paralyzed me from the waist down. My name is Dan, and I've been coming to Children's Oncology Services for almost a year now. I thought it was just going to be one big sorrow fest. Instead of really feeling sorry for themselves, they, they try to make the best of what they had and, and how they lived with it. Like everyone here like, has overcome something. My name is Arnold Navarez. I had cancer in the blood. Sometimes you had to get transfusions. And you need chemotherapy to fight it. My son Arnold, he is a cancer survivor. It was like a year after he was diagnosed, I signed him up against his will. He didn't want it to come because he was still very sick. Camp? Really, I'm stuck on these medications and you want me to go to a camp somewhere? He started coming here so sick, afraid, and now he's like, Mommy, I don't want to miss any camp. <laughs> I feel like... I'm really happy and I had that taken away from me at a young age. Happiness and hope brings you back. You regain those feelings that you lost when you were in treatment. There are kids that come that are very sick, but when they're here, I think they forget about everything. When kids come to camp for their first time, a lot of them are really nervous, really quiet. And like throughout the week, you do so many different activities. You kind of just see that one activity that the kid just like really connects with, whether it's through swimming or fishing or sports and games. And you just like start to see their character actually come out. And all of a sudden, like you realize like three days into camp, the kid, like the really quiet kid, is the kid that's now leading songs at lunchtime and running around. So many people come back year after year. And so you make these friendships and they continue every year. It's as camp as it can get. I mean, we have our own corny songs our own corny sayings. You see people in all stages of treatment, and so it definitely helps you when you're in the middle of treatment, like thinking, when's this gonna be over? Like five months from now seems like 10 years. And then you see people that had your same diagnosis, same treatment, doing all the things that you used to do, and you realize that there is like a light at the end of the tunnel where you can actually get healthy again once you finish treatment. I learned that I could do more than I thought I could, but I think when I'm done with treatment, I'll be able to like, pick right back up with my life and keep going. I came to the like overwhelming realization that people understood what I've been through. But, and I don't experience that outside of camp at all. I think that, you know, what keeps me coming back. I had the opportunity to come to camp when I was seven. And the fact that I waited 11 years to come to camp is probably like, the one thing I regret. To know that if I had just given it one week 11 years ago, like I just hate that. I. I had more camp in my life. Well, it's definitely something that's going to stick with me for the rest of my life. Something I'll keep coming back to, you know, as a reminder to who I am and what I've done, what I've survived. I think when your kid is diagnosed with cancer, you think it's the worst thing that it can happen to you. He's been through a lot of things, but he has survived. It's something that's not transfused into you by machines and all these scary looking devices. It's like you're getting medicine, pain free, like happy medicine. Camp makes me feel happy, it makes me feel normal. Your life can still go on, your life isn't over if you get cancer and you can keep going.
All right, we're back. Um, we've shifted up the seats a little bit here, and now I'm actually being joined with uh, by two people who are really close to the camp. We have uh, Jeff, who is the president of the One Step, uh, I guess, Ch Children's Oncology. Children's Oncology Services, good morning. And Mala, a.k.a. Lauren. Well, M Lauren, a.k.a. Uh, Mala, if you probably turn that around, <laughs> who has uh, assisted and been a counselor and volunteered time at the actual camp itself. Maybe it was in that awesome video we just saw. <laughs> um, so when we start with you, Jeff, um, you know, this is our TF2 community. Um, maybe tell us a little bit about yourself and how long you've been involved with um, the camp and, you know, anything sure. that people might want to know about sort of what we didn't see in that video. Definitely. No, I'd be happy to do that. Mm -hmm. First, I wanted to thank everybody from the community because they were very supportive over the last couple of years. Um, everything we do is all about uh, private donations and for great people like they do and I see donations coming in ten dollars twenty dollars but that's how we how we do things right. it's it's not about the big donation it's about how anybody can help um, Children's Oncology <laughs> Services was founded 37 years ago and, and the whole thing for us was to get the kids out of the hospital environment mm -hmm. for them to be able to feel um, that they can achieve again um, one thing what happens with cancer is cancer is a it, it's a life-stopping moment um, when the life stopping moment that's for the parents the families uh, the kids the siblings and, and for us is to say how can we heal the scars that are internal and not external and because cancer does ca cause the external scars but what it does is the internal scars of fear isolation and and, and loss of, of confidence mm -hmm. uh, what we do is we find we find opportunities to give kids the chance to feel like kids again uh, to bring those smiles out to say you can achieve you can do and, and our mission statement is basically uh, we empower kids with cancer and encourage them to take on the world. And what that means is you can be who you want to be. Cancer is only a moment. It's only a time in your life, mm -hmm. but your life is still ahead of you. And, um, you know, Lauren sitting next to me here is, is a volunteer that uh, we couldn't do it without the volunteers. We have 350 right. wow. uh, volunteers that support the organization. And uh, when it comes to a staff, we only have four full-time people and two part-time people. So we try to make mm -hmm. sure that uh, as many of the dollars we get, they go back to the programs because that's what it happens. And uh, we have 11 different programs. Uh -huh. uh, so when you saw there, you saw our one-step summer camp. And I think one of the things I want to clarify, too, we are Children's Oncology Services, but we're one-step programs. And, sure. and those are our, that's how our programmatic piece happens. Um, when you look at it, we uh, have summer camp. We have a dude ranch trip that actually they're, they're getting on a bus tomorrow to go out to a dude ranch and do all the things, riding horses, do all the great things that, that kids can do in, at a dude ranch. And whitewater rafting, or they go skiing, they go to uh, winter camp, which Lauren uh, volunteers at as well. Uh, but it's all about having fun. It's mm -hmm. all about being a kid again and you know, giving that opportunity. Uh, we were with a, when I talk about the encouraging to take on the world, I was just with one of our campers that uh, she came to camp at 14. Mm -hmm. She was diagnosed with bone cancer at 12. She went through the uh, entire process of, of chemotherapy and, and met multiple surgeries. Uh, her, uh, her left leg was, uh, had multiple scars and she was dragging it along when she came to camp for the first time. And the whole thing with that is um, she saw a person with a prosthetic leg for the first time and saw for her that she was an athlete, she wanted to do things. And at 14, she went home to her mom and dad because she saw that this person was playing volleyball and doing those things. Mm -hmm. um, said, I, I need a prosthetic leg. I can't, I can't drag this around. Right. And so she made that decision on her own at 14. And she went through life now. And, and uh, I was just with her yesterday because she's the uh, world champion paratriathlete. Uh, mm. She won Australia. She just came in second in the worlds that happened in Chicago. Uh, we were fortunate enough to have her work for us for a couple of years, but now she just qualified for the uh, Paralympics and she's going to Rio in 2016. Wow. wow. Uh, so it's significant from what sh what Haley has done, but it's really about what you see at camp. It's the camp community. If, if that's significant, but anything significant. Right. We, um, at camp, and Lauren knows this, we all gather together um, for, uh, for lunch or for dinner or for breakfast, and, and a camper can stand up, and if they made an achievement today that's very special, they'll get up and tell everybody. Mm -hmm. and, and for one, one girl that, that stood up a couple years ago, for her, it wasn't about you know, doing something as significant as what ha Haley did, but significant for her was she hasn't been able to swim for five years because of her cancer. But she went from one end of this room to the end of this room and swam in the lake. And for her, that was a momentous achievement because she hasn't been able to do that. Right. Um, you know, that's what we do. Yeah, that that's the whole thing. And and Ryan, if you look at Ryan, who was the, in the video, he was the dinosaur, right. and he was moving around, and 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 he is the uh, class clown, if you will. But sure. Ryan was diagnosed uh, at 14. Um, he was a basketball player and an athlete, and, and part of it was he um, he was uh, then shut out 
by his friends in his community because he couldn't play. He could, wasn't the la he went from the first guy picked to the last guy picked. Right. Um, and then now he comes to camp and you see it. He's right. the first guy off the bus. But our job is to to fight those inner feelings and and provide that level of hey, if you lost your hair, it's temporary. If if yeah. you have a disability, it's it's gonna it's gonna not gonna hold you back. It's only gonna encourage you. Um, and and that's what we do. And that's to create those smiles. Yeah. So as we look right now, um, I don't think we mentioned, you guys can see on the stream, over $36,000 raised. And I, I actually don't remember the exact number from um, the first tip of the hats, but I think it was around that number total, and we're in our first hour. So amazing. You guys are so generous. Um, please keep the money coming. Uh, I want to hear from Mala, who uh, has served three times at the yeah. camp, or uh, at least three years. I don't know how many different camps you've been to, but um, I guess maybe you can shine a little light on your experience actually being there with the kids and uh, maybe a little bit of what you did. I think you're a, you, you were on the medical side because mm -hmm. a lot of these kids are still getting treatment actively as they go to the camp. Yep. Um, and of course, a lot of the money goes to making sure there's facilities that mm -hmm. are able to treat the multiple different types of cancers and stuff. So I don't know, maybe just uh, give a little info on, on your experiences and, and you know maybe anything that Jeff left out that you want to talk about. Absolutely. So um, I've been in the, commu uh, the TF2 community for a while. I'm Mala, but I'm also Lauren. Um, <laughs> you might not know that I'm a nurse. So when the first tip of the hats happened, I, um, I saw it and I thought, this is incredible. How can I help? So I went on the website and I saw that they needed, uh, needed um, medical professionals. And I'm like, well, I'm a nurse. I can volunteer. So I contacted um, the medical staff and they said, sure, come on up. So I drove up to the camp for the first year and um, it was just an amazing experience. Um, the medical staff, they go ar around with every group of kids. There's a medical office, but the kids don't need to come to the medical office. Mm -hmm. um, we bring the meds to the kids, so if something happens during an activity and they need a medication, it's time for a med, they don't have to walk all the way to the nurse's office and all the way back and make, miss half of, half of the activity. They are able to just take their medication, no big deal, whatever, go back to their activity. Mm -hmm. And I think that's the thing that makes camp so special, or one of the many, many things that makes right. camp so special, is that these kids aren't interrupted. They kind of forget about their diagnosis. Mm -hmm. They can just be kids. Yeah. Um, you know, at home when they have to, they're at school, they have to go to the nurse's office. They are reminded of their treatment every single time that they have to make that walk. And at camp, they just take their pill and move on with life. Yeah. Um, so being on medical staff is amazing. Um, these kids, I've worked at other summer camps, and, you know, kids are kids. Kids are mean to each other. But at One Step Camp, I've never seen one kid be mean to another kid. They're so supportive of each other. One kid might not have hair because they're getting chemotherapy, and the other kids, it's no big deal. Mm -hmm. Everyone's been there. Um, and they just move on with it. And it's just, it's an amazing, amazing experience. So I've been there for three summers now, um, and I, I love it. I hope I can go back as, as often as possible. And just these kids, um, they have such a fun time. It's fun seeing the kids come for the first time, and they're a little bit shy. They don't quite know what's going on. And seeing them change from that shy kid that's kind of unsure, doesn't <laughs> want to leave their parent by the end of the week. They don't want to go home. They right. have such an amazing time. And it's, it's amazing that we can help these kids go through this. Yeah, that's great. Um, we are going to get into more TF2 stuff as it goes on, but we are lucky enough to have these people here to talk to them. We want to make sure that um, you guys know where your money is going to. And I think both of them have done a great job of, of describing just how great of a cause it is. Um, uh, I've said in past that um, well, One Step is a smaller scale charity than some of the bigger streams like Games Con Done Quick and stuff. Those charities, they raise a lot, a lot, a lot of money. Um, I, I guess, I don't know how exactly to phrase this question. It might be a little awkward, but um, just how much is, has um, Tip of the Hats meant to One Step, if you can? Sure. I, I could definitely put it in the, in the figures. So sure. when you look at what Tip of the Hats has raised over the last couple of years, mm -hmm. it really has sponsored and almost 140 uh, kids that wow. go to camp, so it's it's incredible. Mm -hmm. So when you look at that and, and how it funds that, whether it's a, a summer camp program or any other ten programs that we have, mm -hmm. um, it makes a significant difference. And you're right, Alex. You know, from a we are one of the smaller organizations, but our whole focus is to try to stay. We want to grow in how many kids and children we serve. Yeah. Um, and and doing that gives us the opportunity to meet great folks and a wonderful community <laughs> like uh, like Tip of the Hats. And and but it it means it makes a significant impact. You can see your donation at work mm -hmm. when you look at that because it does equate to sending a child to a program. Yeah. 
Um, all right, well, you can see we're back in the game now. Getaway Whale's going to drink some milk eventually <laughs> here once it goes. It looks like the server went down for a second, but we got it back up. Um, I think the information for what the, the server is can be exclamation point server in the chat if you want to join. Good luck, because probably a few hundred people that are actively trying to get into that server. So I wish you the best of luck here. Um, uh, I guess moving on, what um, Mala was able to wow. find information on how to how to get involved herself. Um, is there a way if we have other people that you know maybe feel like not just they want to donate money, maybe they don't have that much money, sure. but they'd like to get involved. They may have some free time. Mm -hmm. If there's a way that people can get involved that way. Yeah, absolutely. If they just go to onestepcamp.org, mm -hmm. uh, there, there's multiple sections there that you can learn about the organization and what we do. And also there's a volunteer piece, whether it's uh, an event volunteer or you have a few hours that, that you can help or uh, if you want to volunteer for, for one of our programs, which is which is fantastic. You know, what, what uh, Lauren was talking about is she goes to summer camp, which is a week long, but we also have uh, day camp, which is uh, three days long. So we have different uh, varieties. One thing I did want to mention, too, is we have the other programs that we have specifically for siblings, because mm -hmm. in, a, in a cancer environment, when sure. a child's diagnosed with cancer, the sibs are kind of put to the side because mom and dad are 24 seven, and right. we have a program like that. And we have a family camp that, that allows families to come and, and get together. Mm -hmm. Because same thing about community, it, what, what Lauren was talking about, if you lost your hair, they, people have been there. Yeah. Same thing about families mm -hmm. and talking about that. But OneStepCamp.org gives you that opportunity to, to look at the, the organization and see if there's a way you can help. Mm -hmm. uh, my email's on there. If you have any questions, if you have things that you're saying, hey, I'd like to help, but I'm not sure, sure. shoot me an email. It's, it's really easy to do. Yeah. <clears throat> I remember one of my favorite things of Tip of the Hats, too, I think. Um, uh, of course, the first time it was, it was a little bit hard. I think we just sort of randomly contacted you guys mm -hmm. and said, hey, we want to do this game yep. stream. And I'm sure it's kind of foreign to you guys over right. there, like, what? <laughs> um, but then we, you know, raised quite a bit of money. Yep. And then the second year, there was a lot more involvement. And I think Mala was the one who, um, at the camp, actually, some of the the, the, the campers themselves actually made a couple mm -hmm. of the um, of signs and, and stuff. Um, I don't know. I, I I, I really liked that. I thought that was really great. Um, is there, because gaming is kind of a weird thing where we're kind of in our own little bubble here, right. and it's kind of like, eh, you know, your general people don't really know, I guess, about it, like parents and stuff. They don't really right. you know, bring up whatever this is that we're doing here. Mm -hmm. Did the kids get a chance to, to know um, or, or sort of figure out, like, how did I actually get the money to get to camp? Like, is there, well, this was raised from this great stream right. and this, this great tip of the hats thing and get some info about it? Yeah, no, it's a great question. We, we, um, we do, every month we push a broadcast out to our community. Mm -hmm. So uh, last couple of years when, when tip of the hats was so generous, mm -hmm. um, we uh, put a broadcast out not only to our community but our board, and we push that through. Mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, a media uh, one of our board members is on one of the local radio stations here, mm -hmm. and so he announced it as well. So we do uh, recognize, and we want our community to know, because it's you know, whatever the donation is, we want people to know that people are helping out, and uh, because that's that's the best thing to do, because to, to keep it and not broadcast it doesn't give that, that, that feeling of accomplishment to the people that are donating, right? Sure. So everybody here, you want to know right. where it's coming from. We want our family or community, excuse me, to, to know. And, and we call ourselves a family, but right. um, but we want them to know we're, we're, we're the people that are helping because, again, that, that 140 kids, it costs $1,000 to send a kid to camp, basically. Right. So that's $140,000 and 140 campers. So we need to know. They need to know where that's coming from. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. And um, can I just say that the kids know two different thank you songs <laughs> oh, um, no. for when people, <laughs> you know, come to visit camp and they've oh, okay. been donors. The kids yeah. will stand up on the tables and sing these two different thank you songs. So they're thankful. They know where the money comes from, um, and they know that that sends them to camp, that that allows them to be there. Is, yep. there, a, is there a TF2 oriented thank you song yet? Not yet. Maybe oh, next year. Yeah. Exactly. We'll work Listen, on I will, that, right? I will go and I will direct <laughs> these kids. <on> how to <laughs> and they'll be ready, I guarantee yeah. you. Yeah, yeah. Like, I don't know what that. you're talking about, weird guy, but that's yep. fun. Yep. Let's do that. Yeah. <laughs> Songs are good. So you come in, you're good. We can make that happen. Well, I think that it's probably about time that we get to the gamers. You guys are watching them play. Um, some great banter um, as I try to figure out all this new stuff that I see <laughs> on the screen. We still have uh, Get a Whale, uh, Mela, the great admirable who <coughs> flew in from Ireland is standing there, sitting there. They can all actually talk if they wanted to, but they're being very generous and letting us have the spotlight here. And, of course, Tagarong, who's wearing his patented tag T-shirt <laughs> that I'm going to steal one later. It's going to be great. Um, I guess we should probably wrap it up here, guys, um, with any final words that Jeff or, or Lauren, you guys want to say about about the charity, about the stream, or anything that maybe I didn't ask that you would like to, to let people know about. Why don't you go first and I'll go. Um, I just want to say thank you. And I think the kids really, really appreciate this. 
um, being at the camp and seeing the kids have so much fun, thank you for being a part of that and, and allowing these kids to go to camp and really just feel like normal kids. Yep. Oh, that's great. We are um, incredibly grateful to the entire community because um, it makes us be able to serve more children and families. It, it gives us an opportunity to bring more smiles, but it also gives us an opportunity to, to have others that really see what we're doing. Mm -hmm. And, and the, the, the one thing that I, I need to emphasize is it, it's this community that makes a significant impact. And, and because of that impact, you know, Lauren can come to, to camp and do some great things. And, and the kids that you see in that video, there's, there's thousands of them. We've served over 12,000 in and since wow. we've been around. We want to serve more. Right. So this makes a significant impact. And so thank you very much, and we're extremely grateful. Yeah. All right. Well, I think we're going to throw it to the gamers and let them play games. Um, this is going on for 36 straight hours pending any <laughs> Internet cutouts, which we kind of took like a pool bet of when that might a happen. It's TF2, so, you know, something bad's going to happen eventually <laughs> um, that we're going to have to – Lang's going to come in and rip apart computers and fix with uh, great speed. But um, everything looks great right now. Um, we see your donations come in. I'm actually going to start reading some off in a little bit here. Um, see uh, the comments that you guys make when you donate. We're almost to $40,000 already. So um, let's let the gamers play some games. I think the next real event that's coming up, or I guess the first real event that's coming up, is uh, the uh, Highlander match. It's going to be the North America versus EU. And I believe my guy Sal and the big man Admirable are going to be casting that, which is <laughs> awesome. And I, I, I can't wait to watch some of that. So um, all right, Pubbers, how's it going over there? Good. Good. <laughs> Who's winning? Ayla. <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> still, yeah, still waiting to get in. Tag yeah. can't even get in. <laughs> I'm a tag. I'm stuck in the queue here. Can't yeah. even get in. It's dire. Multiple thousand YouTube subscribers, and you can't get in a pub. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hard life, man. Yeah. It's tough. Wow. I, need, I just need to get priority from Valve to get into every server. Yeah. Every, yeah. Good luck with that. <laughs> need that We're Robin Walker talks. rocket launcher, too. <laughs> <the monster. laughs> if anybody is listening to this right now and you're playing on the pub, have a little heart. Please. Drop out for me and tag, <laughs> please. <laughs> please stream. <laughs> Admirable can't get in either, so it's just get a whale and yeah, it's and just mail get a whale and mail yeah. in the server right now. Unsmitting. We're just sitting here pretending to play, you know. Shooting bone arrows. Do do. <laughs> I, I have to huntsman at this point. Sick air shot ads. <laughs> I've strictly used the oh, huntsman. Was that a quad? His sponsor told them huntsman only. <laughs> <laughs> they couldn't fly him out here. So, uh, Jeff, have you played any video games before? Is this completely foreign to you? Are we all crazy? <laughs> I'm, I'm embarrassed to admit it's a little foreign to me. I've Aww. done video games in the past, but I've watched this. My son's a big gamer, and uh, so you know, watching him play. So now I think I'm going to have at two years, I'm going to have to pick this up and try to really understand it. Oh, so. yeah, definitely. And then you guys can really beat the heck out of me <laughs> online. So then oh, we, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Were you guys able to get in? The win. <laughs> I don't think you're ever going to get in, buddy. They might have to like, put a password on or something and just make sure whoever's playing is, is, is actively in there. All right, Tag, too slow. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just spamming mice one here. I'm going to wear a hole in this mice. Join game, join game, refresh. But it's go not working. Go MG a little bit in practice. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right, actually. Uh, later on, I think 8 tonight, there's going to be the ulti duo tournament. Okay. Me and Mila forming a dream team. Yeah. Tag and Bonnie, no, you may no, have heard no. of them, also going to be there. Easiest win of my life. Are you life. serious? Wait, what is the, what's the competition? Ulti duo. Yeah, ulti duo. You're playing Banny and, and... And Banny and me. Yeah, the dream team. Oh me and Mila. Yep. Also, we have uh, MG Mike coming in from Europe. He's going to be playing from online. Oh, Even okay. Like say, if he's showing up, I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> before he, before and he I, air shots me. Banny and, <laughs> Ban and I have been most uh, cohesion, and we work together in the past. And, you know, we work very well, so... Help. We're going to be winning that pretty easily. Yeah, we still do have uh, quite a few TF2 personalities, streamers, and, and others coming in. Um, we're going to be rotating people in and out of this couch and seat, and it's going to be great. Um, the great Banny is here. I have not ever seen Banny. The Banny? The great Banny that I've casted games for seven years and never <laughs> met. <laughs> he's going to walk in, and uh, yeah, he's going to have like a, gl like a glow around him. It's going to be great. Um, so you said your, your son plays games. Mm -hmm. Has he played any TF2? He has not. What? Yeah. We're going to have to change that. We're going to sure. change that. Yes, I know. I'm going to I'm going to go straight home and say, "Listen, your whole gaming perspective's changing, and this is what <laughs> you're going to start doing and and raise a community there." But, how, uh, how old is he? He's 24. As I said, the great Banny has poked his head in. There's no camera on him. I want to take one and show. He's got the Froyo Tech sweater on, looking fantastic, itching to get into the fantastic. server and just destroy fantastic. people. Fantastic. Um, 
How old is your son? What 24. Oh, he's 24. Okay. Yeah. I was going to say, is this subject material to graphic form? There's oh, he's some... ready to go. Yeah. Nice. He, he's, he's, yeah. Do you know what game he plays? Do you, can you think of one? <laughs> I, I know on he's, a, he's, a, he's a more of a, he hasn't jumped on a PC gaming side. He's more of the oh, other side. So game. trying to get him in the console game into the, into the PC gaming f format. So we've had some conversations, and I've got to be a little stricter on, on what he's got to do. So. <laughs> it, it, to the community <laughs> side, I will make that happen by next year's time. We'll be All talking right. about this in a little different way. So, ah. okay, the pressure will be on as soon as I leave here. All right, I like okay. that. I like that. Yep, yep. All right, so Mala, you know the events that are happening today. Mm -hmm. What are you most excited about? I guess even tomorrow, we have the whole 36 hours ahead of us, or 35 now, I guess. I really want to see Dota Fortress. I missed it last year because I had to work through literally the whole stream okay. on Night Shift, and so I'm very excited for Dota Fortress. Yeah. If you guys don't know what Dota Fortress is, I don't know if I can do an adequate job of explaining <laughs> it because it's, it's really cool, but it's uh, basically they're banning and picking, um, I think, classes and, and people mm -hmm. to, to fill out a team, and it's really awesome. It went over really well last year. Um, there, I wish I knew the guy's name off the top of my head who coded it, but it is like dozens of hours of coding work. It looks really cool for the, for the thing. And, um, I guess we should also give a thank you, not just to all the people that are here, but um, to all the people that helped code stuff and helped Lang and company, um, you know, just the amount of work that goes in. When I arrived here, it was just crazy. Just everybody was running around trying to figure it out, and I think it's come together. Um, you know, we're anticipating, I guess, a few problems, but it really looks great. And people have been here for days in this, this Ignite Land Center, which is really cool, mm -hmm. too. And um, I can't just thank enough for all the people that have put, like, real time in um, as well. So, yeah. You guys get in yet over there? No. Still working on it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I'm talking to Star. I'm trying to get him in, but oh, he's having man. the same problem as you. The Star? Oh my God! The real Star. Star. I don't know if you can hear me. Oh my God! Is that Star? <laughs> is that Star? I'm, just, I'm sitting here. It, it's hmm? I don't know what the situation is, oh, but I'm trying the... to get into pubs. Everyone <laughs> is trying to get into mm -hmm. pubs. Yeah, I think there might need to be a password put on or something. There's five thousand people right out a door over there that are bashing their heads together to figure this out, how to get people <laughs> into a pub. <laughs> You're just going to have to get lucky, I guess. Ooh. Map changing over there? No? Oh, uh, I think I got in. Connecting the server. Nice. Uh, uh. Nope. I'm scared. <laughs> I think I got her. It's not. Adds it, are you trying to get in too? Absolutely. With, uh, well, a stop. Six 36 days, hours, everyone's going to get it at some point. No, just I, a, it's just law of averages. I got into a server. I don't know where. Are you able to get in? No. <laughs> I, I, think, I think I'm on the Borneo one, so we're good. Of course, Star is the one who gets in. Just <laughs> clicks in. Star, did you get married? Is that what I heard? I did. I did um July 11th. Well, congratulations. What a majestic day. Well, Star got Thanks. in. How is it? Is life different now that you're married? It is exactly the same. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the truth about marriage. I, I said it was kind of like when someone asks you if you're, uh, do you feel a year older? No, it's, it's, it's been a day, dude. Ten years older. <laughs> so, Jeff, you said that you've watched this before. Mm -hmm. We have TVs right in front of us here yeah, where we're, yeah. we have what's, what's going on. Uh, what the stream is actually just being presented on these actually big screen TVs mm -hmm. and it looks really cool. Right. Um, how much of this you're able to piece together? Oh, it's it's it. You know, I'm watching it. It's, it's tremendous, and I'm just happy that when I said I wasn't playing, you know, Team Fortress, that the weapons didn't turn my way <laughs> and start coming this way at you me. You want so that weapon? Yeah, that, that's exactly. That one makes seen, you feel good. I, I just like seeing what I need to have when I go in. Yeah, yeah. So no, this is this is great, and watching all the activity and things going on here, and just watch, you know, one weapon turn into something else. It's amazing. It's great. A yeah. lot of activity. Feel like if we put you on the spot, you'd be able to play a little bit, or would you just? Oh, that'd be Ooh. dangerous. Well, I'd, I'd be going down really quick because that weapon would be turning probably on myself. But we'd, we'd probably let you do that weapon first. Yeah, that's the medic. So that that guy's just healing people and making which sure he doesn't get hit by too much stuff, which is good. If that's nothing else, it'd be entertaining. But that's yeah, the class yeah. that <coughs> that Mala plays and admirable plays. Yeah, <laughs> the nurse plays well, the medic. Well, of course, of course, it just fits really well here. Yep. Okay, um, so we're going to shift up the uh, the couch. I just heard from the production people. Um, we're going to have a new host and people sitting on the couch here. So um, why don't, I guess, one more time uh, say thank you very much, Jeff, for showing up and 
was great to meet you and talk to you about the camp and, and your experiences. We really appreciate all that, that One Step's done to, to you know, work with us in the stream. Yeah. No, we, we appreciate you guys. I mean, the thanks all goes to everybody here. Yeah. And everybody that's put this on and the entire community. That's, you know, that's all good. You know, everybody out there and, and everybody in the community, thank you so much. It means a big deal to everybody here. Yeah, and Mala, why don't you, I don't know if you're going to be able to chance to get back out here or not. Oh, I'll be here Okay. for good. the whole stream. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll well, be awesome. Back. All right, yeah, I will be back as well, but we're going to shift things up. So we're going to throw it to the gamers, and uh, we'll see a different crew here when we're done. Great. Thanks, everyone. Thank you. So, Tag, have you uh, managed to get in yet? No. Still just watching this menu screen. Two problems. I love video games. How I'm much do you love them? I'm watching the stream on the big I TV. I love playing them. Tell us about it. Yeah, Honest. you can imagine you're in the game. Yeah, I'm just gonna. I'm just watching Ghetto World's POV, and I'm. It, it doesn't really feel like I'm watching myself because there's some questionable rockets. But oh, <laughs> see you later, Mela. Never mind. I Mela's think it's better best. without oh my you God, here. That's a that's a triple. It's a triple, baby. Oh, baby. Triple. <laughs> a triple. Oh, baby. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Fantastic. Thank you. Hey, Stream, I just want to shout out. You might see a guy there playing Medic. I think it's like SHD Steven. Is he the guy that donated the two golden frying pans? One of them. Or maybe two. No, got, I don't know. We've got three pans now. Three pans. Yeah. It's almost wow. like. Enough to make Whenever a we had nice one pan, it was exciting, it was like rare, but now there's three. A nice fish dinner. Yeah. <laughs> golden pans. <laughs> tag. Are we on the stream right now? Have you got uh, a golden yeah. pan tag? Yeah. Uh, you hey, still Grant. working on that, buddy? I'm still working on it. <laughs> still yeah. working on that. I, I keep getting a glitch at the end of all my tours. You're where a sleepy head this morning. <laughs> good items. Yeah. No, I, I texted Slynn and he said, uh, we're going to sleep a little bit. Yeah. So how's this, how's this pub going along, Mela and Get a Whale? Are you still on Huntsman, Mela? Uh, yeah, I am. You're right. Last tip Great. of the hats, I played Huntsman for maybe like five total hours. Do, do you need any pub. tips on how to play Huntsman? Because I, I can, I can give you some tippers. Uh, no, I don't. I don't take tips from sixth place invite teams. He played on sorry, HRG. Man. You know that. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? Second place? You? How many times? What is second place, Tag? I don't even know what second what place is. What is second place? I just know what first place is. I also do know what this menu looks like, because I've been looking at it for a while. It's a very nice menu. <laughs> it is. It is a, it's, it's a, a custom HUD. Tip of the hat yeah, it's a custom HUD. It's a tip of the hats HUD. Um, maybe you guys will see it sooner or later. I don't think we're going to let you on, Tag, actually. We're, I heard you're an onliner. Yeah, I'm j I just cheat. That's what I do. <laughs> just an onliner. Choke when it's a live situation. I've never done that. <laughs> uh, what is this just the, like, <laughs> <laughs> I don't have anything to look at, so I just had the stream up on my phone. Dag is at Tip of the Hats watching the stream I on have, his cell phone. I like <laughs> sitting at the gamer computer. I'm, I'm at the gamer computer. I can't get in the server, <laughs> so I might as well just. That oh, pub sure looks fun. Oh, Tag. Yeah. <laughs> Love to be playing some TF2 right yeah, now, It's guys. like I'm just looking in through a window <laughs> at some like a buffet or something. Living the life of. Yeah. It's like I'm looking in the window of a Chipotle. Living vicariously through us. You can give us pointers. Do you want to use the mouse? Want to use the mouse button? Yeah, sure. All right. <laughs> so yeah. we got the tag get a whale combo now. Okay. So are we going to be like rocket jumping too? You're going to let these I, guys I, don't I, think do, we're, I don't think we're going to need to. You want me to, to do the arrow keys? Fight? You do the mice? <laughs> All right, do uh, it. You guys are cute. <laughs> All right, we're going to go up Who's here. a cuter couple? Admirable and Mela or Tag okay, get a whale? Okay, we're dead. As soon as that, I touch the keyboard, okay, we die. Right, answer, wait, really. we, we need to not walk straight into this person. Okay, we're going this way. Should I be I jumping? I feel like you guys uh, no, 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 all, all right. have this Let's cool inside here. joke I don't get but because I think I'm not there. there. No, yeah, to the side. Keep going to the left. I'm just the Golden not there guy. Stream. Get right, hyped. We, we got a boy. <laughs> we... I'm sizer. Two kills. Just, Keep going just... back. Keep going back. We need to get that health packet. Oh. oh that was Star. Star. Oh. oh, my God. Steve. So lucky. <laughs> He got, yeah, he just got a lucky kill. Sick pan, dude. I right. think it was luck. A lot of what Star does is luck. I've seen his videos. Someone just killed our just luckiest Spencer gamer in life, for sure. <laughs> All right, we're going to go through the left. Uh, ads, have you tried connecting through console again? This says it's full. That feels like a Bible. 
Try it again. There we go. That's what I told uh, <laughs> that's good. to do in the work. Good. Uh, nice. All right. Jump again. We got gunboats. We no, don't are do it. 34 don't health. Do it. We're going to die. <laughs> we have the old gunboats. <laughs> There's pyros on this server. We were talking to Seagull I don't think I can the play. gunboats and you could rocket jump and take 6 HP. Mm -hmm. Seagull's here? Yeah. He's arrived? Yeah. yeah. The Seagull has landed? He is flush. He's way here. <laughs> Pag, it was a valiant effort. Yes, it was... It truly was. Get some tagarinos in the Twitch chat. That's not an emote. Put some tag T's and tag S's. Get some tag T's and tag S's in the yeah. Twitch chat. Bag T. Bag T. So, Ads, you never got in yet either? No, but I'm I've trying a new method right now. Two of my Steam friends got in. I don't know how that worked, but not you. Are we not Steam uh, friends? It's, it's pub dot. Oh, yeah. yeah. So are we switching to that server? Or? Missed the no, air no, no. shot. That's huh? just, I, I sent this connect info to uh, Star, and he got in through it, so. So what's going on, Tag? How come you couldn't get in? But Star could. Not famous enough? I thought you were a, I thought you were a celebrity. Substandard uh, streamer. Of this era right here, as you can see. Oh, what? Yeah. I just... Oh, wait, that's... Spam that retry, buddy. Wish I had multiple monitors. Port, maybe? You could use your mm -hmm. monitor as port? Twitch chat so we can yeah, follow... Maybe. Yeah. You know? What's going on? What's the Twitch chat having to say? I am a toucan. Um, uh, the Twitch chat is saying exclamation point has pub. Right. Stir is letting his medics die. What a noob. I am <laughs> I a stir. three. I can afford to lose one. Nope. That's Star right there. 100%. Can you guys hear Star? Nope. I can't. No. I think they can. Yeah, he's yeah, in our mumble. Can, we can. can we join that mumble? We're having a conflict. We just listened to him, his lovely voice. I, I was in the mumble until the computer rebooted. I'm just scared to talk at all in case I'm talking over Star. I don't want his fans to hunt me down. Star is more me. important than me, that's for sure. He's bigger than Jesus. <laughs> the biggest Twitch celebrity <laughs> in the world, man. <laughs> I'm going to be talking as admirable for the rest of the stream. Shut it down. Just shut, just shut it down. Mike, I don't know what you're talking about. Not a dying man. <laughs> I'm having a blast. I can't. But Germa's in Mumble as well. Hey, hello, Mumble people. Uh, hello, Mumble. Hello, hello, Mumble people. Can you hear us? I, I cannot. Are you there, man? <laughs> Give me something to interact with. I got a potato one. Hi, Seagull. Hey, Mike, that's a great advice. <laughs> Talk like me. Can you do my voice? <laughs> Could uh, ads cancel? What what port did you use? Five head. <coughs> hey mumble people. Now could, hey uh, Dashner, could you make mumble louder? It's pretty quiet. Yeah, I, that's uh, why it's quiet. I thought I heard. No, I heard stir suddenly. What port are you working with? What's Blood. The one? Blood sire. Yeah, we, we can hear you. It's strange. Got him. What's up? I killed Star. I can go and I'm, I'm good to go. I can leave now. Not me. Nice walker jump, get a wall. Thanks, man. I hit the tree the first time. <laughs> I was waiting for that air shot so bad. Not that I would have gotten it. All right. Hey, we're time. back on the couch here. A little confusion as to mics and stuff. Uh, I got Justin Bloodsire Danford sitting with me yep. on the cooch. <laughs> and we want to say real quick, because we have someone special in the, ser in the server that they're playing on. Um, Justin, this guy is uh, is the hero of the hour right now. Big donator, um, donated two golden pans to wow. our uh, backpack. Those are 
Those are the item of dreams. So um, yeah, big shout out to him. S H D Steel Shadow Steel. I don't know We're gonna say that. Shadow Steel. Shadow if it's steel like a lot Shader better. Steel or something. <laughs> I'm very sorry, but we can't really read that well. Shed Steel. Shed Steel. And of course, awesome. those items will be. Um, you can you can bid for those items, and when you donate, uh, you can decide if you want your your uh, your donation to go towards uh, the raffle. That'll be for for the golden pants. We have three golden pants, so so that's. Uh, that's six yeah, six K bones, man. <laughs> yeah, about and yeah, every single one of those that you can you can donate. Yeah, and I was just talking to Jeff uh, backstage, not really backstage in the other room, and uh, <laughs> he is gonna. There's a, a yearly event that they do. It's kind of their their trademark. I brought it up in uh, Tip of the Hats past. They have a, a poker tournament, and um, the winner of the poker tournament actually gets to go to the main event poker thing at the really? World Series of Poker. If anyone knows what that is, hi. Oh I'm yeah, a, I'm a poker nerd. <laughs> um, gamers play poker, uh, but. They're giving us, I think, four seats. And he was like, going to give it to me. And I was like, no, I mean, I'd take it, but <laughs> we should probably give those out. I don't know One, if, if we're going to be able to do that. So <laughs> hopefully they can. But that's cool. So, that's um, fantastic. Yeah, all the information about what you guys can get for raffles. Um, I mean, it's the backpack is insane. I mean, it is. And when you donate, make sure, you know, if you guys want to fill out your, uh, your name or your alias, we'll be able to read those. Yeah, we got a lot coming in, but a lot of them are un anonymous. They're, they're not named. They're, there's no donor name and there's no um, actual alias. So uh, we would like to read your, your comments, but make sure we can credit that to somebody because it'd be great. You know, you can give some money to the children and, and read your, we can have your, uh, your message read out yeah. on the stream. Um, I believe coming up, if it's not mumble people, gamer people, do you guys know if, if Highlander's coming up in 10 minutes? Or is it an hour and ten is minutes? Is it? One of those. Seems right. I think it's an hour and ten minutes. Admirable. What do you think, buddy? No idea. Okay. I think it's that's the next big event. I'm not. I think it might be in an hour and ten minutes. But um, we have a, a bunch of money coming in. Um, again, if you guys want us to, we'll read out ones and please fill out the do the donor name. Um, we appreciate the troll ones. They're very funny. <laughs> Thank they you. Are, they're always funny. <laughs> but um, um, yeah. Obviously, we can't read all of them up. Tag is getting a lot of love in the donation comments. Uh -huh. But they're anonymous, so I can't attribute the love to Tag. Uh -huh. It's his parents. Tag, people love you, man. What what are, what are they saying? Your mom and dad are donating. They say, I want a Tag shirt. Oh, really? No, I oh. made that up. But they say, I love <laughs> our high Tagarung, and then a Rolled. smiley face without a smiley face. It's just uh -huh. a colon and a star, uh -huh. which might be for star. <laughs> colon and a star. Looks yeah. like we do have the Highlander. North America versus EU scheduled for the 2 p.m. slot, so that's uh, that's Eastern, so we can wait that. Yeah, we are in Central time, by the way. We are. In Wondering Central. if people can hear me. Hey, I, we can hear you. I don't know if you're. I'm sure you're on stream. Star. We can hear him. So yeah, I'm, I'm on stream, Pauling. but my buddies. Hey, Pauling, come on, I'm me, busy. Me, Pauling. <laughs> Go, do the fingernail ripping off thing. What? That she does. What? You, you gotta watch the source material. This is the world famous stir here, huh? Yeah. Follow the lore, Tag. I'm sorry, I, I'm I not God. followed up on this lore. Follow the lore. She rips off fingernails, that's what she does in her spare time. <laughs> that's attractive. <laughs> gotta do something. Yeah, that's true. So, so, so you guys, what's, what's, what, what are you looking for to here? What, what do you want to, what do you want to see in the tip of the hits? Oh, I want to see some... video games. <laughs> Possibly I'm so excited. Thanks, thanks, Tag. Well, uh, yeah. 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 I mean, thanks for coming out this I year. Don't, yeah, yeah. I want to <laughs> see some server or something you other. Set your goals high. Something other than the main screen of Team Fortress 2, and waiting on people to leave the server. Why don't you MG warm up? Are you yeah. just gonna Debbie down the whole stream the whole time? That's me. You know me. Tag, Steve. I let you use my mouse and you weren't interested. I got two kills. Hey, uh, I have a lot. I just yeah. want to point out, I can't attribute anything to this person, but a very generous human that exists donated two thousand ninety dollars and eighty one cents. And there's no name, and it just says hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> hi. Thank Hello you. Back. Welcome to Tip of the Hats. You are a hero, sir or ma'am. Thank you. Of course, one hundred percent of all those donations do go to the One Step Camp, and um, you know, we had that great intro before with. Yeah, that video was awesome. It was so I think great. all these all these Ubers are waiting for me. I'm getting that vibe from Mela, who can't even hear me. And he's no, mad. He can hear you. I don't know if you can hear him. Oh. Yeah, everyone can hear oh, yeah, He, he hear just you. wasn't you talking, talking to you. Oh, you can. Oh. Oh, oh, we'll have a conversation about what we're looking forward to besides video games. This guy uh, in the, I mean, this guy it's, in been, the it's been played out to the maximum, but uh, 
me and me and Admirable just taking ulti duo by storm. This yeah, guy in the right. server said it's not the real star, by the way. Is it? Is that true? Did he see his weapon skins? No. It's totally the real. Is it not the star? real star? Are you not the real? Does what? he have his own? I'm being outsourced. Does to he have his own Is that the now? real star? No, but he has. Oh, okay. Hello? Valuable skins. Now, star, how many stars are there? And infinite. You, I well, would do, assume do you if have, there's parallel universes. Do, do you have like you know like dummies like you know like a uh, how how you know like really high high like. I think he subscribes I, I to people. the many worlds theory of the universe. Is what he's Tech, saying. have you not what? had your Chipotle this morning? You like, <laughs> I haven't eaten yet. <laughs> that is like true. That is true. But like, do, do you have like doppelgangers? Like, do you have do you have people that you send into the field in case they get assassinated or something, or like mobbed by a bunch of group of yes, you know? Like, four of them have died. Four of them. Okay, four we don't star doppelgangers have died, and we don't talk about it. They don't died. have like they don't have like a commemorative plaque died in the field pretending to be stir. No, it was heart disease, the silent no. killer. No, okay. The more you talk they, about it, the more die. They they know but what they're getting, getting into. you're getting one killed right now. I'm sorry. Is it the one that's in the server? Get a will. No. You gotta hit those, that buddy. That guy is trash. <laughs> that guy's what? Oh. That guy is trash. Hit that Because get a will just apparently get a will just killed that doppelganger. I think he's about to get that friend. Oh, that's not Mela. Okay, never mind. That <laughs> was. Everywhere this doppelganger goes, there's a pyro air blasting him. Um. <laughs> I want to interject real quick. If you heard uh, the sound of a clumsy man putting on a headset, <laughs> <laughs> that was admirable cranking up our headset to the biggest it possibly goes to get around the giant head. And here he is sitting <laughs> on the couch next to a very small man, and it's hilarious. Oh. Thank you. You want to oh. sit on my knee, buddy? <laughs> I get nursery like a baby? You need oh. a white oh. beard and a red hat, <laughs> and then maybe we can get that going. Admirable, you didn't get to play yet, but you're here. How do you like Chicago, Illinois, USA? Oh, I've been uh, soaking up the American culture, man. I went to Chipotle with Tag. I follow his Twitter feed, and he's just like such a fanboy of this Mexican restaurant. And, and how did you like it? It was incredible. <laughs> Flying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I went to Dunkin' Donuts. Are you serious? Yeah. You oh, man. Tag, you didn't take, take him to get like a slice of Chicago-style pizza. <laughs> we, we, don't have, we didn't have enough time to like go out. And we're we, we're doing setup. Did you take him on the bus? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Get some honey butter fried chicken too. Yeah, oh that yeah, the fried chicken very is good. American. That's that's dude, chicken dude, with that's dude, what we butter got. dipping I, I, sauce. I'm sorry to interject, but is anybody noticing how many soldiers are jumping me? I just you know just want to say some people are like oh every well, time the camera's you on Star, game. he's dying. I just there's like three in a row. At my this wedding, I'm gonna play the video of me. I'm gonna play the video of me market gardening Star at my wedding. <laughs> Pretty exciting. Just gonna be on a hundred inch projector, all in slow motion. Well, we'll see. With Lincoln Park. <laughs> this is the end. Get a well's gonna get married oh, uh, next year's tip of the hats live on. That's yeah. gonna be a forty. Wow, well, I didn't mean segment. to say any. I don't want to say anything this year, but <laughs> me and Tag are getting married next year. Tip of the what? hats. And Am I? Wow, it's legal. It is legal. I don't I'd know like if it's still legal for your Canadian, ceremony, please. It's very legal for Canadians. Absolutely. We can do anything. Um, there's a twenty-five hundred dollar donation wow. from Wait. an anonymous human. What? And they say another anonymous human. They say sup. <laughs> What's up, Steve? man? We, or woman. we love you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you, anonymous man. I, I always feel like it's always those big anonymous, like those always big donations are always anonymous. Yeah, and you know, you guys can attach your Steam ID to these. When cool. I'm, I say like 75% of these have their Steam ID on them, mm -hmm. but this guy or gal doesn't have a Steam ID. It just says sup. And when you attach your Steam ID, that makes you eligible for the jaunty pin that will right. go out after the event. This guy could get, game like, item. you know, quite a few of those. <laughs> Let's do math. He'll get a jaunty <laughs> pin. But when you donate, you'll be able to divvy up where your funds go. So there's tons of raffles and there's tons of great prizes that we have. Mm -hmm. And when you donate, say you donate $100, you can, you can divvy up where that goes. And then you can also get in on our bidding wars. You don't have to donate again. When you put that money in, yeah. you can go right into those uh, bidding wars, so you can get a big bang for your buck, and you're also helping out children in the meantime. So I'm putting all my money to save stuff. the animals. Tag is putting all his money into a golden frying pan. He's been <laughs> trying to get one for how are years, centuries, I think. Yeah, since golden frying pans rifle? began. I wish I knew, Star. I should <laughs> say because that's got to be the big ticket item, right? Everyone wants those. Um, I'm guessing someone who knows more will tell me, and I could tell everybody. But I'm pretty sure if you donate. You're eligible as long as you put your Steam ID in. That's right. Don't mm -hmm. quote me on that internet, well, but well, on the tracker, it's the same tracker as the AGDQ. Right. So people should be familiar with that. If they're not familiar with TF2 in general, but they're yeah. familiar with that, you'll be able to pick what 
raffles and what auctions you want your prize to go toward. Um, yeah. And there's the golden pan. There's a there's a Counter Strike crate on opening tomorrow. So oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. And, um, You're gonna be there for that. I better. <laughs> <laughs> Gamble those skins. <laughs> uh, Twenty dollar donation from anonymous. It's more fun when I get to say your names, people. But it's fun because in all caps it says, "I love you, Stir. I love you, Lang." Even though this is the first time I've heard of you. <laughs> That's That's good. Very Keep reading, buddy. <laughs> you just trails off, and he says, "Oh, by the way, nice scream. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much." You. This anonymous person, by the way. Same. This this person must be loaded. Loaded. Oh. All right, we're starting to get more names in, so we can start attributing donations to people. That's good. That is good. Star, do we have you lined up to do anything special? You're not rapping um, this year, are you? No, no. That happened Most one year? Definitely. I don't... Kind of. <laughs> Unfortunately, German rap. Forever. The internet German bullied you into embarrassment. It was great. Yeah, Remember. but I, I flipped it on him. You Flip did. Mo. Flip Mo's the greatest. That video was great. <laughs> the video from last year was entertaining. <laughs> well, don't expect it this year. I woke up at 6 in the morning and, like, worked on it for four hours. And then <laughs> it was the worst thing I've ever made still. <laughs> of course... If you guys go to tipofthehats.org, you will, will be able to see um, all the events that we have lined up, all the guests that we have ready for you guys, um, yeah. and find more information. And below the stream, too, there's a whole list of, uh, of very useful information that will help guide you guys throughout the event. Yeah, and if you guys are here for Highlander, we have the king of, well, the prince I'm of Highlander. I'm going to claim myself as the king, king of Highlander. You're king of TF2, yeah. so you're... You, you <laughs> oh, oh, get a whale. Oh, that's all your grounds, right. but that's coming up in an TF2. hour. It's going to be EU versus NA. And no one gets more pumped up for this than Admirable, who has, you know, he's such an EU fanboy. I'm the, the token Admir Euro Admirable. here. Are you going to have uh, Aaron, the same guy as well, but <laughs> I feel like I'm representing the rest of the world, you know? Yeah. It's, it's very North American in here. I feel kind well, of we threatened. Are, we are in. You see me cowering in the corner of the sofa. Don't hurt me, blood sire. <laughs> Those guns. Put them away. Can't reach <laughs> <laughs> uh, Real quick, a $1,000 donation from oh. Polecat. Huh? And... Uh, Thanks for hosting this amazing event. So, Polcat says, thank you. Thank it's you. Really awesome. Thank you, Polcat. You're the real hero. And, and uh, if you send a donation, there are a million coming in. On camera, uh, too. Or, I guess, thousands. And we can't read all of them. Um, we apologize. We are. Uh, Justin has his laptop there. And I got a little tablet thing. Um, and we're seeing all of them. So, keep them coming. We really appreciate it. I think it's over, over $46,000. Every time I look to the top left yeah. corner, it's a big number. And it's getting bigger. So. And even if you don't want to leave a comment, Every donation name does appear on the stream when it happens. So yeah. make sure you guys give us your names, and at least you'll have that moment of uh, of satisfaction when you see your name and your dollar amount. Yeah. So who's playing in this Highlander thing? Tag? I don't know. What? Uh, I, I'm playing with it. I think I it's a team that Stabby Stabby put together. He's playing Spy, of he's, course. Is he here? And uh, No, he's not here. Drove his boat over here? Oh, that <laughs> team, he wanted Here's to an idea. Yeah. Killed around the country. We're on uh, the lake, man. He could get... <laughs> the he could, but, uh, actually, yeah. Lake effect. What, is he from, he's from Florida, right? I don't know. I'm not sure. I just know he lived uh, in a boat, because yeah, we used to have him fully charged. Nah, he's in Cali. Oh, that would be a that's, long... That's a tough houseboat. We got ride. a guy here from Cali. We got two guys from Cali. Yeah. We have Steve Lynn and Grant Finson. Oh my god, Slynn is here. Yeah. Oh. Twitch Slynn. That is going to be incredible. This is Lynn. Of course, Twitch. Big like shout out goes to Twitch because oh, they, yeah. Yeah, they really help us. Not only are we, we providing you this awesome event via Twitch, um, but Twitch really stepped up and uh, helped us out. Um, made it possible for, for us to really be no. uh, live in this Ignite studio. So. Yeah, man, I, I literally would not be here if it wasn't for uh, no, Twitch's support, so uh, thank you, Mr. Slynn. You're going to get all the credit, buddy. Mr. Slynn, Twitch John, the hero of TF2, yeah. the heroes of TF2. Just the god. Yeah. He's not here, is he? No, oh. unfortunately. Another shout-out to Jeff from One Step, who's just yeah. leaving the venue. What I was going to say, let's get some clappers going in the Absolutely. chat for him. This is what a clapper looks like. Clap test. Yeah. Um, <laughs> he's stepping out. He's awesome. Yeah, he's he awesome. a great job, too. Yep. He was awesome, yeah. I was like, please speak about it, and then he just did. And like, then he did. Great. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Siegel. Yeah? Are you liking the pub? If I could join, it would be really good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, when this round is over, maybe I'll drop out and let somebody flock in. I feel like it my won't stead. be either of us that get in, and then we'll have one less person. No, no, I think you would get in because of the reserve slots. 
like one reserve slot down. We're not on our pub server. We're, we're, we're in the, oh, we're not. Yeah, we're not in ours. Oh. Oh, once we get on there. Yeah, yeah you haven't. <laughs> I Be tried Gucci. to explain that. To you. Yeah, so Mela is like just been delusional this entire hey, time. Slim is here. There he is. Hey, there he is, the man himself. So that's why I couldn't connect all that time because Mila was leading me on a merry dance. He <laughs> yeah, was like, "Yeah, hey, go to this server, buddy." I joined. No one's there. Thought it worked for stir. <laughs> <laughs> Had to get stir in, buddy. He's some. Oh, yeah, no, this, is, this is a good old Valve-grown pub. I was actually playing two hours before Tip of the Hat started, and the Sentin Shield Master guy was still on the server. He's just been hanging out, waiting for Tip of the Hats to start. He's a trooper. He knew. That's smart. We had quite a amount. What an amount of viewers in the Twitch chat last Even night. Even yesterday, yeah. Yeah, 12 yeah, so hours before the, before the streamer went live. So um, a big thanks to everybody who's tuning in people then were, and now. Yeah. People were camping outside in their little tents. No, that was <laughs> just a homeless person. Oh. Yeah. Uh, you did, you, uh, got those things. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if you're homeless if you have That a was tent. C -Pair. He hadn't shaved yet this yeah. morning. <laughs> I didn't shave this morning. We uh, all just walked past morning. Morning. I woke up a state away. Right? You I, know, I, I drove two hours. See, C Pair, we were talking. We were probably just going to take one of our bear plushies. Or something, or, so. or we're just gonna have you on the couch and not say anything because no one's really ever seen you. <laughs> and everyone will be like, Who is that guy on the couch? What are you talking about? Yeah. I was on well, webcam. He's got gifs. There are gifs. Oh, yeah, of him. there are. GIFs. There are. Yeah. Him freaking out on webcam. Yeah. Those are the days, true. man. Then you grow up. And, <laughs> <laughs> and then it's bad. Unless you're cool. You like grow star. up and have a bad back. No, my back's great. Well, well you're eight feet tall. Good so. for you. <laughs> you're lucky. All right, I have, a, I have a donation or two I want to read. I lost it, though. Uh -oh. oh, oh, here it is. Okay, I have a twenty-dollar donation from Pooh Pants. <laughs> <laughs> so who has, has a question for Stir? You would like to know, Stir, if you like coffee. Coffee, dude? No. I, I talk about how I hate coffee like all the time. Oh. Grandma tried to get me to drink it, and I just, I'm not a coffee boy. I am also not a coffee boy, so high five to that. Really? Yeah, yeah high five. I've, I've tried. People I've tried just don't accept you times. when you're when you're not ways. a coffee boy. I mean. So what do you do for caffeine? Are you like a... I don't partake I'm in that I am very rarely a caffeine really? boy. Occasionally oh. I Red Bull. No, so, sometimes do I'll... you Red Bull, bro? Yeah, you know, it's all even? natural over here. Yeah. I don't partake I make in my it. own caffeine. We were drinking some Balls Guarana uh, energy drink yesterday evening. That stuff's classic, man. Yeah, That's right here at the Ignite Gaming Lounge. That's nerd right. stew. Chicago, Illinois. It's great. I love bowls. Yeah, and if you guys are in the, Thank you, the Midwest area, the Ignite, this place is awesome. It really is awesome. Yeah, like, it. just walking in, yeah. it's really cool. I mean, I've actually never been in a proper, like, eSports cafe, but, you know, you think Land Center, you think of, you know, I don't know what you think of. But Did you get the not those Cafeteria like, tables. Oh, yeah. If they don't let me play, I'm <laughs> punching, <laughs> looking at you. Let this is like the, the dinosaur couch, you know? Yeah. I think, uh... <laughs> Yeah, we should we should get a chance to play for sure. I try to tiny little. Pub. If you ever get to the server, yeah. Dude, I will play. It's like riding a bike. <laughs> I don't think you've played since they've come out with all the weapon skins, huh? Nope. No. Have nope. you played since like season two? No. I mean, I last time I played this game was over a year ago. But we don't. We don't need to worry about that. See, yeah. Star is a stat track. I still watch. There on I still I, I I lurk streams oh, when okay. I get a chance. I see tag stream. Yeah. I see Banny. He's just streaming every night. Just to live in the dream. Just killing it. Um, okay, I have possibly the most um, Twitch donation ever, but it's generous, so I'm going to read it off. This is the only one I'm going to read off. That's just so trolly, it's great. <laughs> uh, it's a $69.69 donation, and uh, it says, I like dogs. Franker Z? Question mark? Franker Z, yeah. That's the dog. Yeah, yeah. I just want to see a chat full of friends. E dog. <laughs> that's that's a meme. Let's get some pog champs in chat. That's a that's an emote. <laughs> I don't know what the word is. <laughs> just it's a fan out, favorite. Just throwing out <laughs> emotes now. <laughs> just yeah. dropping names. Yeah. Let's get a smiley emoticon. <laughs> we get some XDs as well. You know? Yeah. I like memes. Yeah. <laughs> Lol. I have a hundred dollar donation from anonymous. Please put your names on these because these are funny. A uh, hundred dollars says, please tell Tag this this was meant for him, but the kids are more important. <laughs> Hashtag for the kids. <laughs> the With kids. A Z. Yeah, the kids are more important. It's kind of a mixed message. <laughs> I mean, Tag, you're pretty good, but uh, the kids needed more. I mean, Tag I was, was a saying, kid once. I, I was no saying a whisker a biscuit. Kid. And I, it was a mistake, honestly. I should still be a kid. I don't <laughs> know what I was thinking. You didn't want to grow up. Yeah. You were a Toys R Us kid. <laughs>
Uh, $5 donation from uh, Bread149, who says, You guys are awesome for what you do. Apart from you, Star, <laughs> you know what you did. <laughs> you know. I, I know. You I look at the chat it. and I just like have deep regret. So I know. <laughs> you know what you did. You want to make a confession? You know, got something you want to get off your chest? Or... Uh, this is your chance. This peanut butter. <laughs> Peanut butter is good for your skin, and that's not a joke. What did? Okay. <laughs> that could be a stretch goal. I'm not. I'm just gonna like not. Tune into that that Tip of the Hats After Dark thing? this evening, <laughs> where we're gonna be shaving Gatawheel's head, and then we're gonna smear it with peanut butter. It's great for <laughs> Who your knows? skin. It's gonna just snowball from there. I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> the I heard we were shaving here, guys. your head too, but I think you already got started. I've with got, that. I've got some growth. You man, got a few days growth yeah. there, you know. It's been going on for months to get rid of girls. Achieve the hidden man. All right, I've got a, I've got a question aimed towards the the big man. It's a twenty dollar donation from DJ Is Bows. I okay. think I read that right. Okay. Um, it's long. I'll try to get through it here. Hey everybody, hope to be able to help reach the stretch goal. Feeling really charitable today. So the money to spend, I want to thank Star Germa, Mela Tag, Admirable, uh, everyone, for being freaking awesome. I love TF2 community. Uh, question: uh, What do you think of the EU competitive side? Admirable. I think you know we're uh, we're still reeling from the, just the a bunch of gimmicks. Yeah. I fifty five. <laughs> just a bunch of gimmicks. But we're adding more unlocks to the game because essentially we need more gimmicks. We had gimmicks <laughs> at I fifty five, but didn't produce a result. I wasn't there. That's the another thing we need to have. I need to be a land next time. But like, there's so much energy in the EU scene right now. Uh, teams yeah. coming together. Epsilon have returned. Uh, there's lots of tournaments being organised behind the scenes. Uh, Sideshow is going ham on that. Even Mr. Slynn is getting involved in the European side of things. Who's we have that? big dreams, like uh, you know the matchmaking hype. Valve have said they're going to bring in matchmaking. Yeah, just bringing you up to speed, Seabro. Right? Oh, I've heard of that. <laughs> Not that. I've got Twitter. <laughs> but we're all, uh, we're all, we don't know when it's going to be. You know, Valve time. But you know, everyone wants to really get as many tournaments out there as possible, just to coincide with this right. lead up to matchmaking, build the hype, and. Uh, Particularly in Europe, yeah. People seem really motivated. It's yeah. kind of like whenever we lose a LAN, people get mad and they're like, next year, this isn't going to happen again. So just they start like putting their super teams together, yeah. Whenever you guys go to LAN. Yeah. Admirable, <laughs> how, about a, year. how about a new <laughs> medigun to make you good again, Admirable? Huh? How about a new medigun to make you good again? A new medigun to make me good? Ooh. I am past it, man. You know, I don't even oh, try and play what? anymore. I just cast games. Well, that's I have to dodge these <laughs> shots coming in from... I have <laughs> never played safer in a pub in my life because I picked up some guy's golden pan. I've just never seen one before. That's awesome. That's nice. Though. Can you I describe can't even it? I'm happy to play with at I least once. I can't even get in the server to pick up someone <laughs> else's golden try pan now, to use the it. The map is changing. The map is changing. This I'm is your chance. Go for it. Uh, it's better to keep... Oh, there you go. All right, Austin. I, it, it, I'm gonna get the. I have one hundred dollars from Gil. Can we have someone kick him? Uh, I want to keep. A, wait, uh, I'm going to keep donating until Admirable tells us his pregame steak recipe. <laughs> that of course the is Gil uh, from oh, I'm sorry. Scrap TF. Uh, I don't know. It just seems to be every time I'm talking to him, it's like. I'm casting a game on a Sunday or something. It's like be right back eating a steak. So it's become <laughs> it's become a little in joke between us. But steak is my casting superpower. That's how I feel. Uh, the hype cast. That's how I get pumped for EU. We're in <sighs> Chicago, the capital of steakhouses. Hit so me with some beef, bro. We'll go pick you up one. <laughs> <laughs> you know, on the topic of NA versus EU, uh, we do have these show matches that will be occurring. And when you donate, part of the bidding war that you can have your funds also go to. Um, will be to determine where the server is that these oh. players are playing. Nice. So I think all the Europeans out there probably want to want to get in on that because we all know how North America is vastly superior <laughs> to, the, to the European scene I've heard based that. off the I they do better online. Results. Well, it's much of cheating. If you're in if you're in Europe right now, you want to make sure that you go ahead and donate towards that bid war to right. uh, um, get your team their server. We just passed oh fifty thousand dollars. Right now. What? I fifty thousand dollars, nerds. So what? Already? What? what? Fantastic. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry, I mic. talked over it. How much? 50,000, Star. We're like an hour wow. in. We are We are one hour 50, and 13 000. minutes in. That's 50, half 000. of last year, pretty much. 50,000, is that all? I and we have to do better than that, man. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. <laughs> you got to be right. ruthless. 50,000, that's all on, you got? Come on, <laughs> an hour we're, one. we're pretty close. Of course, we're million. going 36 hours. We're going right to Sunday, tomorrow night, 12 a.m. Eastern. So, 
you know, I, I don't know. I didn't think of any predictions in my head, and I don't really want to get into it. But 50 already? That's yeah. You guys are great. And Sh when I got here, Sean's like, hey, "Have you heard? We basically passed first year's total. It's like we're 30 minutes away from going live. How's that possible?" But that's really, really cool. And we are getting them all in. I will try to read the good ones or you know the ones that catch my eye, right. my fancy. And 100% of all of those donations do go to the One Step Camp here in Chicago. Um, they help kill kids build memories, friendships, hope for the future. Um, it's, you know, us being gamers, uh, we're all about having fun. And it's great to see a, uh, a cause um, that's all about ha letting kids who are going through difficult times yeah. also experience the yeah. joy of being a kid and have fun. Um, we had Jeff... Right. He has a long last name. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll, we'll omit <laughs> that. But he has one, I found out. Oh, okay, good. And he's not here to tell good me, it, so I'm sorry, Jeff. Yeah, but he was uh, the president of, he is the president of the uh, Children's Oncology. He did a great job explaining all that stuff and uh, going into depth about, you know, the video itself was great. I'm sure we'll show that video again right. at some point in the 36 hours, but um, your donations are going to a good cause. Um, speaking of, I have a $750 donation Whoa. from an anonymous human being. It's always the best. Or a lizard with... An opposable thumb. <laughs> uh, shame I'm missing out on this stream due to work, unlike last year. But I know you guys will pull through. Pull through. Onwards, sons of Badlands. Yes, thank you. Sons thank of you. Badwater <laughs> Basin. I was born in New Jersey, which is the Badlands. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Yeah, Badlands too. How do you pick the weapon up? Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. There's a golden pan. Nice job, get well. You deserved it. Golden pan. <laughs> yes! I did it. You got one? He's dead, is what happened. Well, he died right side of the spawn. I did it. I did the thing. Get a wheel. Can you describe to our viewers just the feeling of having a golden pen? Ads, why are you doing this to as me? As soon as I held it, my <laughs> blood Sorry, look, pressure. Look at the tag's eyes. And I tell him, <laughs> tell him what it feels tag, like. As soon as I held it, I felt sort of a pulsating feeling, which was sort of the nerves in my hand. Um, becoming active. Then my blood pressure skyrocketed, almost to a dangerous level, <laughs> but in a good way. I can't this. Then my cholesterol <laughs> went way up. Then I got arthritis. It was terrible. <laughs> Usually that domino is at a different You ever different see the order? movie Jack with Robin Williams? It was like that. <laughs> I got real old, but I didn't look like it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> we have a $50 <laughs> donation anonymous says I am a Chicago area native last year I watched the stream just for fun however at the beginning of this year my best friend Blake was diagnosed with cancer on his 16th birthday oh. now I am very grateful for this fantastic event that brings together the awesome TF2 community for a great cause that is very personal to me thank you for all that you guys do so thank you for that $50 donation and again guys um, you know you can list your name or an alias just so we can uh, we can credit that to somebody other than anonymous who seems to be the top dog yeah we're getting more mm -hmm. names in now which is good okay. anonymous though going huge it's always ham. the big ones going for him. Him. Going big in the paint um, I have a hundred dollar donation from mm, OD is a lot Ode? of OD. yes thank you that's my boy and he actually <laughs> says hi Mela oh. hey or what? Mabla. <laughs> That's my boy. <laughs> That's my boy. Uh, okay. Tag. <laughs> but no, but he's okay. Hi, Mabla. My Mela. Can you say hi to Tag for me? So. <laughs> oh, hey Tag. Hey Mela. That's your hundred dollars. <laughs> Thank you. Sir. That, that is that is a textbook Uday yeah, donation. Really is. Yeah, really. Is he a sub? Yeah. Yeah. He's, he says that in both of our chats all the time. Say hi to each other. I don't know why he's in your That's chat. That's sweet. But okay. Saying hi to people is nice. <laughs> Siegel caught it. I'm Siegel, kidding. did you get into the thing? Uh, no. No. <laughs> Guys, listen. You want to play on this computer? No, don't talk to me. What? What? That was a friendly gesture. Austin. Can we oh, get a settings a, are all wrong. Can we get tag frag out of here, from please? Stir? <laughs> I want to know what 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 Stir's frags are right now. He's got the cannonball. He's got that loose cannon. Not cannonball many. Cannonball Z. Getting chopped in half by samurai swords. Is that the real Stir or is that the the kind I think of it's an imposter. I feel like that joke was like not funny six years ago. But <laughs> I don't know. Maybe maybe I just heard it too many times. We're bringing it back. We're bringing it back. <laughs> it was never gone. No. I'm just like staring straight down at my desk. At tag. tag life is hard sometimes, isn't it's, it? It's truly a challenge. <laughs> and there it is on stream, one of the golden pans. Truly. Mm. And there are three of them that uh. you guys can uh, enter into a raffle for. Um, and again, a big shout out to 
uh, Shadow Steel for providing two of those. Yeah, I don't um, know if he's still on the server or yeah, not. But um, that guy's awesome. Very awesome. Incredible amount of money. That Very expensive two, yeah. items, um, and they're here for you guys to uh, bid towards. Steel was actually trying to get us hot peppers, like ghost peppers, for oh, the yeah. event oh, to no. eat in person, but it oh, never oh, oh, panned no. out. Well, that's good. Oh, no, no. That would have been entertaining. He is I a pepper farmer. I do yeah. one. He has, he has, like, hotter than ghost peppers. Oh, like the Carolina Reaper? Like the hottest, yeah. We, like, we would have, we would have made the news except not for not in a good way yeah not, <laughs> we, not that would have been a stretch goal <laughs> that we would have met and yeah. then the cast would have ended because nobody could talk three from dead at charity stream events <laughs> we, we'll keep, <laughs> we keep <laughs> slim in the reserves we'll keep slim yeah, yeah, yeah. Free, he, so he he's gets, here to he back us up it was terrible the but donation incentive raised one million dollars for kids with cancer unfortunately three dead yeah three dead <laughs> three dead more pepper. injured <laughs> ghost pepper related yeah. injuries ghost pepper related injuries on a plus note uh, I have twenty dollars from an anonymous human who says, first year watching Tip of the Hats question, where can one start competitive TF2? Good question. Thank you. There's all sorts of resources out there. Um, of course there is uh, you can head over to comp.tf, which is a uh, I believe like a wiki page that you can set that up and there will be more links mm -hmm. um, to a whole uh, array of resources. There's also TeamFortress.tv, which is sort of I would the say TeamFortress.tv. Yeah. Yeah. On, on TeamFortress.tv, we uh, host newbie mixes. Mm -hmm. um, those are exactly what they sound like. They're they're six v six games geared towards getting newer players in the six v six game mode. Um, yeah, newbie mixes. You can play in TF2 Center. Uh, that is a lobby based system where it, it just puts you into six v six games. You can join those. Um, and ready up in there. Uh, comp TF is a is a wiki um, with just a bunch of comp competitive team Team Fortress Two information that you can read up on. So if, you do, if you want to do your homework before you jump into those things. Yeah, I want to give a shout sides. out to newbie mixes because <laughs> what I like about newbie mixes are you get hands on like coaching from top level uh, players who are playing competitive now, and it's for any skill level. And it's great. And some of the people that we have here actually have done coaching. I know Banny has coached newbie mixes sometimes. Uh, a lot of the invite players and whatnot. I like that. that he just named out the person that's not in the room. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he would be right okay with Of course, hopefully that. matchmaking will have you uh, coached? Yes. When? provide a, like a when better, first came out. better source. Okay, not recently, though. Not in the past six to eight months. Has he coached? Yeah. Been, uh, yeah, within the past six months. <laughs> Ash and Ninja Nick have as well. Fascinating. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder how Ash is as a coach. A uh, hundred dollars. Ozzy did. Oh. Sorry, you go. Hundred dollars, <laughs> Mike. Calm down over there. All right. Your hair is getting taller. Uh, Not from for long. Poe Diddley. Not for long. Are you actually shaving your head? Yeah, hundred percent. Well, only if we reach the goal. You know, the only if we reach the goal. Five thousand dollars. People got to donate. Now I just want to see Admirable's head shaved because what would he look like? Are we getting the <laughs> the wet shave? You know, the big, the foam. Oh, oh yeah. my god. To the skin. To the skin. Maybe just dry. I don't know about you the know? foam. We can do it dry, Admirable. <laughs> We're going in dry. I think I'm adventurous. Excuse me. How about, how about what if we cut it short and then get waxing strips? No. We oh could do god. that. Yeah. You yeah. want to buy the waxing strips? I'll do it at charity stream event. Yeah, this sounds horrible. Isn't it? <laughs> so wait, you said it, Sea Bear. I, I was asking if it was actually happening. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's uh, happening. No, no, but the wax that's strips tonight. If you want to get wax strips, yeah. Okay. That's happening tonight after midnight during what's called uh, Tip of the Hats After Dark, the which is an hour. official, yeah, an official <laughs> schedule item this year. Last year it was just sort of ad hoc, but this year we're planning it. Of course, that's a stretch goal, so they, yeah. they have to meet that first. How can how can how I donate to help hat? that? I have money in my pocket. You go to tipofthehats.org. Can I give it to you? <laughs> and then put it in a. If you give me the money, it's not going to go to one step. <laughs> It'll go to get to like I aloe wish cream it for your Jeff's head. gone. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right. Wait. So how can how can people online donate? People can go uh, obviously to uh, <laughs> when they go to donate. There are several bids uh, that you can go to. It says bids. One of the bids is uh, tip of the hats after dark. Admirable and get a whale. Get their head shaved. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah. Under the other bids, like the NA EU bid war for the ping and stuff like right. that, it's just another one of the. Uh, wow. And bids. again, when you go ahead and donate and you pick which raffle you want to ent enter into, um, you can then go right down underneath to the bids yep. and also choose the bid. You don't have to get back in um, uh, with, with the extra funds. You can use those funds to enter into the bid. So If you want to see some bald heads, I mean, j I'm just saying, you know? 
We uh, just got an announcement up there on stream that we just reached 100 subscribers on oh, our wow. channel. Ah, really? Yes. Um, wow, that's yeah. awesome. And I, they, they told me something about that that money is is doing something special that is different than all the rest of the money. Ooh. But the money that we're getting from the subscribers is something. I'll figure that out later. I think we so. get the. I read that, this that is, on that the is dog, the we get the full amount. You know, normally Twitch would take a cut, right, right. I believe. Like, obviously, they're... Well, if they're not, they are not. <laughs> they're working with this on the event. <laughs> Thanks, Twitch. <laughs> but but from what I read of that document... Yeah, yeah, and we're also rolling over the emotes that you're able to spam That's in correct. the chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and they're beautiful emotes. They are. The only one that I can remember in my brain is the one with Lang's face. <laughs> They're How many Lang faces? I don't want to reveal them because I don't know what's been approved yet and what hasn't. But they are beautiful emotes, um, and with the more subscribers we get, the more that we will be able to release them. There's also, since we're talking about Twitch, we have that Teespring campaign going oh, yeah. on, yeah. which yeah. is you'll be able to get T-shirts much like the one beautiful. you see here, only much better as it and will have a, the Twitch logo and not a kid's medium. Yeah. <laughs> this is an extra small. Oh, okay. But and then it's also <laughs> a quite uh, a little bit better material. Now uh, see, and that's a great. Now official see, Twitch shirt that you can get in on. Going on the extra small tech, you know, <laughs> Bloodsire with those massive guns, he gets the extra small. That's right. To show them off. That's right. It's not because he is a small person. We call him Young Rhino. It's because he has it makes giant me look muscles. bigger. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We have to do a group picture at some point while we're all here. And just point out that the average, what would you say the average height of your TF2 personality? It's slash six person? foot. I Five. would say it's yeah. yeah it's it's up there. I don't know what these people are doing playing video games <laughs> when they could be basketball players. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, my options were limited. It was like wrestling, like running, gymnastics. I had to Sniping. play video games. Sniping. These guys Pyro. could be playing. Uh, they could be pitchers, right? Basketball players, football players. Belly itchers. Yeah, you chose video games. <laughs> don't get it. You have to be tall to itch your belly. You have otherwise, to be tall to have a belly. That's just, just the way work. the body works. Man, oh. do you have a belly? I do. It's all. <laughs> I think all of us have bellies. Star, you can't assume though. It's 2015. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Don't try to corner people into having a belly just because you want them to. Um, I have a hundred dollar donation from an anonymous person. Unfortunately, it says shout out to Sean Bud, Lang, Whisker, and Curtis. Curtis the Gamer for their hard work behind the scenes to make this incredible event happen for the third year in a row. Hashtag, hashtag Hot Lang. I got ahead of myself there. I miss the hashtag hot lang, hot lang. the most of all things TF2. That was last year, right? He's going to light himself on fire, donation center. That's exciting. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, when are we fire. doing that? <laughs> That's right after your thing. Okay, great. Wow. So right before Oz Fortress, Lang is going to set himself on fire. Yeah, that's cool. I'm that was sort of the that. last second edition. I won't be able to see that probably, but the Oz Fortress. Well, thing, you'll be able to see it from we'll like to show it. five blocks away because it's something to see. The next big Chicago fire. But yeah, hot, hashtag hot lang yeah. Yeah. caused by hashtag hot lang at a charity stream event. <laughs> well, the good news. <laughs> he kept making jokes about the Chicago fire. He's like Aunt Bessie's goat or something. Uh, uh, we'll a, we'll a, have to good check thing with Lang later. <laughs> It is incredible, though, what those guys have put together for years, bike to bike. Yeah, like no, it really is. I mean, I remember when they were sort of struggling to get the first one off the ground, and that sort of didn't look like it was going to be a success, and then it was a really good, great success, and then the next year they tripled their... Yeah, they've never, like, they've never sat back on the laurels and said, no. we did a great job, let's do the same again. Each time it's been, like, bigger and better. Yeah. Here we are all sitting together in the same room. Yeah, and I think it's... Some a of my heroes, you know, here. <laughs> 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 Tear it up, guys. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> Zoom in on the tears. Uh, it, real. it is. It's pretty cool though. Like just the first year, everything being online, and then the second year, I was there just playing. Cause yeah, it was at there. Kurt's house. Yeah. And I lived near him, so I mean, it was just me, Kurt, and laying in his bedroom, just like setting yeah. up all the computers and stuff. And now it's at an actual right. venue with right. all the TF2 community people. It's the progression is pretty amazing. The production well, team. How do we been how do we top it next year? Next what year, we, that's scary. Next year we just at have Valve, to go to space. Square Garden. Next year we run out. Yeah. Madison <laughs> <laughs> Square, Square Garden. Madison Square Garden. get the garden. One hundred percent of the Team Fortress 2 community. <laughs> It'll be at the international. We'll just take a, a day. Big, big part of that is our community for everybody watching the TF2 community. Um, really shocked and surprised all of us. I think. Yeah. Our goals each year. Um, I think were uh, very humble, and then we were even more humbled by what the community. Um, presented to us. They opened their hearts, they opened their wallets, uh, and they really made this into what it is now. Without the community support, um, we wouldn't have the justification to do what we're doing here right now. Yeah, and I'm just, uh, there's so many big donations that come in, and I'm, you know, like this anonymous donation of $1,000, no Steam ID, no name, 
and it just says, "Hey, Lamau." Hey. <laughs> hey. Hey. hey, you sir are a hero. Do yeah, you know who just hero? arrived, or ma'am? Do you know who just arrived? You person. Oh. Who? I'll give you a hint. His name starts with an S. <gasps> Salamander. Sal's here. Stir. Oh my God. Well, Salamander has entered the building. He's in the building. Oh, That's here? exciting. Well, yeah. he's getting ready for. They're they're fluffing him up for his an inaugural <laughs> cast of the, now, of the, the day. Who's the fluffer? <laughs> Slim. Uh, <laughs> it's the Slim Banana thing. Yeah. No. Uh, Slim B. Yep. Uh, hi. No, uh, but Admirable and Sal are going to be casting the Highlander action EU versus NA. That's coming up in 30 minutes. Yeah. And then we're going to intersperse. You have the schedule right there, don't you, Justin, on the platform? We do have it, and that comes up at 2 Eastern. And how can people find the schedule? Is there a way to, for them to see it, or is it for us to know? Well, it will, I believe it's under the stream, but it will also be on tipofthehats.org. Tipofthehats.org. Yeah. Mm -hmm. find it. There's many different ways. And under the stream, we have all sorts of nice links and information for you to go yeah. um, investigate and find out. Um, but the easiest way to make sure you don't miss anything is just to stay here for yeah, the keep it on. Hours, Absolutely, right. right. Leave that stream running. Uh, yeah, me and Sal casted the, the Highlander EUNA last year as well, I think, so uh, now we get to do it in person, you know, we're taking it to the next level, our relationship has progressed, it's getting really serious, guys, you know, <laughs> I'm not <laughs> sure how I feel about this, but I haven't seen him since, like, what was it, like, I-40? Yeah. 42, 3? He's, uh, yeah, I hope he lives up to the gingerness, I haven't seen him yet, so I'm excited. I'm starting to peek his head in. He's probably eight he feet tall. Ginger. Yeah, probably. Nice. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, I have a couple donations here. A $50 donation from Kent. Can TFC legend Justin the Bloodsire AA play the guitar while Get Whale serenades us? <laughs> Keep up the good work, boys. Get Whale is not here. Get Whale left. And I don't know if there's a tiny little guitar that you can play, like a ukulele. Oh my god. <laughs> it could be a normal sized guitar, but yeah. I don't believe there are no. any musical instruments on site. Uh, and I don't think we're doing the karaoke thing, so... Yeah, we'll just um, not do that. Yeah, we spare you all by uh, deciding not Are to you play. not going to sing uh, A Whole New World with DGC again? Oh, that was goodness. the highlight of my life. Thank <laughs> you. That was something. <laughs> it was a pleasure, know. everybody. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. Uh, I have a $20 donation from Mars, God of War. My own experience at summer camps combined with memories of a couple relatives who have passed as a result of cancer moved me to make a small donation. What a great cause. Keep up the awesome work. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. That was heartfelt. Should read some serious ones every once in a while. Yeah, right. yeah for sure. I Lamau. <laughs> hey. It is a very emotional event. Like even watching the that one step video at the start. Yeah. I've seen it like a bunch of times, but every time I see it, it still hits me right in the feels, man. Yeah, it was really good. I didn't. I wasn't expecting it to be that. But I mean, I was kind of we're shifting well around and yeah, yeah. sitting down. I was watching. It's like. It's really good. Really, really good. <coughs> I'm sure we'll show it more than that one time. It's only a four minute long. And really, I think you can see where your money's going, and it's, yeah. it's mm. hard not to want to donate after seeing that. Had an opportunity to see the Twitch chat during that video, and it was a lot very, of sad uh, boys. Uh, very, a lot of Bible thumbs. A lot of Bible thumbs. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of Bible thumbs. <laughs> <laughs> but, but super serious, none. No, but, but serious. And everyone knows that it's a good cause, and that what we're doing here is, is special because. Poor Mela's just sitting there looking at us. Can't get into a server. Yeah. You, you I got like I got kicked on the map change. Yep. Really? Server filled up all the time. Yeah. Now it's I'm rough. the only one in the server. You're lucky. <laughs> get a whale. Seagulls just. Oh, you're playing under get a whale. On a you guys are wondering why get a whale just suddenly got yeah. decent at this game. <laughs> yeah. This tag. Tag's yes. playing horn. Um, Seagull in or no? Not yet. Oh. Yep. Well. Okay. Um, I do. I have a uh, one hundred and twenty-five dollar donation from Nick. Uh, much love to everyone at Tip of the Hats. You are all beautiful people. Fantastic stream. And here's to breaking last Hi. year's record. Hashtag for the kids. For the kids. Thank you for so much, kids. Nick. Most of the donations that are coming in are including their Steam IDs, but you want to make sure you do that because when you do include your Steam ID, we will be able to provide you with a jaunty pin. It's an in-game wearable item. Oh, yeah, but you have to get at least twenty dollars at least twenty dollars at least twenty dollars cumulatively over the course of today and tomorrow like you can't lowball us with you a one dollar for a do jaunty pin what did lang say he was going to do he's going to just deal them out to people <laughs> he's gonna so. yeah he's just going to make it rain <laughs> jaunty pins on the tf2 community as soon as you include your yeah. id there but make sure you do that because uh it's another bonus that we have available to you guys um i don't want to say this dude's full name but a hundred dollar donation from andrew 
who says, keep up the good works, folks. TF2 has a great community, and it's wonderful seeing them come together for a cause. And a really good cause. I'm going to ad lib words into his donation. Good. <laughs> well, well said. Thank you, you Andrew. Andrew. Really appreciate it. We appreciate all the donations. We're getting many of them. Uh, many of them are still anonymous, so make sure if you want, you know, uh, some acknowledgement for a donation. Um, don't just write a comment. Write your name so we can give you the proper shout-out. A lot of I Lamaus now. <laughs> <laughs> Quite a few. Of course, you don't have to use your real name. Just give us a pseudonym, you know? Yeah, Maybe give us a pseudonym. Pseudonym. Just add a little color to the donation, you know? A bit of character there we can riff off. Yeah, like uh, Sergeant Tater Tot. <laughs> <laughs> and he has, the, he has the trademark after that, so oh, don't copy that course. name because he will sue you. <laughs> uh, donated $25 and says you guys are nerds. <laughs> that is correct. He True. got us. True. Dang. What, what makes you roasted. say that? We're <laughs> roasted. <laughs> Let's get the roasteds in chat. That's an emote, guys. If oh, yeah. you sub, oh. there is an emote for roasted. I'm just... Did we unlock it, it yet? There. Yeah, it was unlocked. Is it unlocked? I don't no. know. We're, we're I not think sure. It, I think it, Can we get a stats actually, check? Actually, I think it is. Nice. Everyone's 100 spamming. subs should have unlocked that. Yeah. Nice. So. It's just a, it's a stick it's with marshmallows There's that are being toasted. Emotes. Is that what it is? Yes, that it's, is it's beautiful. That is great. They're actually the best emotes I've ever seen they're, in they're my life. They're fantastic. Nice. You haven't seen my channel's emotes. Yeah. All right. Tag boss. Tag, you have a channel? Hello? Seabury, what? What? Why are you doing this? I'm reading. Oh, stuff. Was that Get Away? That was Get Away. Was that Get Away? Trolling me? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's Seabury. I have never been tag. trolled in my life. I'm sorry, Seabury. I love you the most, Tag. Okay. Wake up, Tag. I know you do. I'm Can we sorry. get this guy some some Chipotle, please? Please. Chipotle. Please. Chipotle. Please. Please. Can we get some Chipotle? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, stir. Was that a star that I heard? Hey. In the, uh, yeah, I'm I'm hanging out. I'm just getting a one v eleven in this pub. <laughs> stir, did you have a bagel this morning? I could have. Did you go to finagle no. bagel? I I had the opportunity, but it eluded me, and I had to stick with a homemade quesadilla. I'm gonna ask my Seabird doesn't know TF2 question. Does Lock and Load have three shots now? Yeah, they, oh, yeah. they changed it several times. I think actually they wow. finally you weren't around. It. They they buffed it, and it was crazy overpowered and now it's like yeah it's a little overpowered it looks it's like pretty overpowered yeah. but no, it, it, it only it does it only does extra before. damage to buildings now wow but yeah but it's still it's still so fast it's still so fast yeah it's yeah. so easy to hit weren't they going to allow it in etf12 but then they banned it again yeah we had a little like uh, test whitelist there you know come yeah. up in the pre-season i was pushing for more unlocks you know because i don't really play anymore i love to see people suffer <laughs> so i was like get all the unlocks in there they tried it out but there was a bit of a backlash, so I think it's not going to make the cut. Yeah, that's all too good. Permzilla, though. It's a yeah. work in progress. If, if you guys in the server can hear me, or, or, or you're, you're pulling stream slash playing duties, um, last year, you know, Jerma got the love treatment. It seems like Star is getting the troll treatment. I'm not sure if that's fair. I think that's kind of mean. I have a picture. That's pretty normal. I, I, a screenshot I took of literally every other person but me on our team healing Jerma. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah, now everyone just wants to kill Stir. They just want to show that they're better than him. Yeah. They want to get in there and do some damage to the. Pe people's cameras stir. were ready last year, though. We're getting the cameras ready for Jerma. Yeah. He's going to be here. Or not in here, but he'll be on here. Yeah. He'll be point. pubbing and all that later on. A lot of Jerma fans that I'm getting in the donations, and he will arrive at Mumble at some point and be his Jerma self. Guys. He's uh, he's having his room sawed. Tag nice. <laughs> <laughs> having his room what? His room is being it's very loud where he is, so he's gonna be around at the uh, the 4 p.m. pub session. Uh, he couldn't really be around right now, but that's later. I mean, it is a 32-hour event. It's not like 36. Uh, 36 hours. Oh, Come did on, I say 32? Why did I say 32? Not sure. Well, I don't know. Eight. I don't know. Is that how many shots the sniper rifle has? No, it, not even. <laughs> nice backpedal, dude. Whoa, nice backpedal. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, I play this game. I was just talking about the sniper, guys. Uh, we want to remind you guys that uh, we do have that bid war going on um, for the North American versus European Highlander um, battle that we have going on. And when you bid towards that, you'll be able to determine um, what server these teams are going to be playing on. And like we mentioned before... Basically, who do you want to win? Yeah, it, Ping's going to be... These guys are playing uh, over the internet, so Ping is going to be a big factor in determining uh, who gets the, the upper hand 
Um, so if you want to see your continent win, uh, go ahead and when you donate during this hour, um, when you donate, actually, it's ending soon. So if you donate now, um, you'll be able to not only get in on the raffle, um, but determine uh, what continent you want that server to be located on. So go ahead and do that while you still have time. I'm going to make myself uh, perhaps unpopular with my European brethren, but I think if you want to see a close game, and that has to be like one server or the other, probably the New York server is the fairest. Right. Like, sure, the Americans would still have a, a little edge there, but if you want to see ping play less of an issue, vote for NA, you know. I don't say that often, but... Uh -huh. Wow. Over yeah. sportsmanship or demonship. This uh, guy's been just out. totally converted. <laughs> We're turning him It the was the Chipotle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying what they want to hear, you know. It was the Chipotle. One L ride later. I'm in the lion's den. And uh, Marvel, you know that Kool-Aid we gave you yesterday? <laughs> <laughs> it was tasty. What has been your highlight of America so far, uh, excluding this building? I don't know. It's been kind of... Obviously, I'm here to cast. Yeah. So the last couple of days, it's been a little bit, you know, pensive. I've been waiting for the action. I've been looking for jobs to do and stuff. <laughs> but uh, I guess I have to say, this is the highlight right now. I'm sitting here on the sofa with Bloodsire and Sea Bear. Yeah, I'm not on the sofa, but <laughs> you <laughs> can I'm squeeze in maybe. Later. Later. There's room. Right. There's yeah. room. There's I take room. up a small portion. <laughs> We're just at the start, man. There's a lot of time. <laughs> Uh, so I guess, would, how long until that donation incentive? I don't know if you said uh, that. Well, I think that, goes, that goes only until, I believe, the end of this hour. So okay, so right, right up to when minutes. it's going to start. Right. Yeah, and that's going to be a two-hour block, I think. Right. Maybe a best of three action? Yeah. That's yeah, it is. Mela's playing in it. Yeah, playing, you playing demo. Demo. So if, wow. if, yeah, if enough people donate for a European server, it's going to be a disaster. <laughs> that will be fun. He's banning <laughs> that as well. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Guessing probably. I know it's The like only people I remember group. are me and Stabby. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. nice. We're Stabby, of course, be the fun. I think we're gonna have mumble comms for that too. Yeah, there's guessing? gonna be mumble. We're gonna mumble have the whole bunch of features. Good. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be <laughs> good event. <laughs> That's some more. Um, back to donations. Uh, you know, I have a donation, a fifty-dollar donation from Hand Farts. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a As friend one of does. a friend of mine died of brain cancer recently, so the stream has some special meaning uh, to me. Also, I'm watching you stir. Everyone is in the pub. This is the most one-sided pub I've I ever am trying in my, life. my best on Gittable's account. Look at these kill streaks. Thanks, Tag. Tag. Come in People here and help think me. I'm good. Yeah. I have a no, seven kill streak. I reminded me. them <laughs> while you were out. It's not you. Remember, it's not get a whale. Kind of sent us for a loop there, you know. He calls himself Hans Farts. <laughs> gets the big laugh and tells us about his Yeah, he hit him all. Hand farts. Of emotions and then there, yeah. he Thank goes, you, Hand Farts. <laughs> yeah. It's like that sort of sentimental, <laughs> sad, Ooh, and then straight into threatening, oh, sort of creepy, like I'm sucker punch outside your window. Well, we have we have a user named <laughs> Wizard that I'm sure will be donating sometime the weekend. Oh yeah, yeah. Is our good friend. He's in the Hall of Fame. We don't want to swear too. M I have not sworn yet. The wizard. I'm sure yeah, it's coming. Wizard. But <laughs> well, I'm not. If he donates, <laughs> like he has been, he gets his name right on stream. Yeah, he always seems to show up for the the big donation drives. Like he hadn't played the game in a year or something and there was some EU fundraisers for I-55 and he was like messaging me on Steam because we saw the donation coming up and he just like he just loves TF2 yeah. there are so many people like that that save up money just in order to make donations to these events and it's such a it's such a great thing it's such a big deal yeah and we want to make sure we get as many of them read as possible but it's impossible to do that um, sorry we're trying our best here <laughs> um, I'll, I'll read another one here from Katzy uh, as a Canadian who Catsy. has never never eaten Chipotle or Qdoba, can Tag explain the pros and cons <laughs> between these two choices? <laughs> there you go. I mean, honestly, I, so on on my stream, there's like a there's like two factions of Qdoba and Chipotle. I've only had Qdoba once. Really? I, I enjoy I enjoy Chipotle more. I I dramatize it, but uh, I think the biggest difference between the two is the how they prepare the rice and the beans. Oh wow. Now you have factions on your stream yes. chat. Yes, it is very serious. Factions. I just saw a big Weird. It is a Chipotle house yeah. up there. And Qdoba boys. So what if Lang comes home with like a big sack of Qdoba? Uh, I move out. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys. Okay, well, there you go. You couldn't get Chipotle as the tip of the hat sponsor. I know, right? <laughs> Maybe next year. Who would think? Maybe next year. You know, going back to large donations, I believe on tipofthehats.org on the bottom of the page, it's actually a Hall of Fame yep. um, where you can read a uh, list of the uh, the most generous donors that we've had. Um, so certainly, yeah. If you, uh, you know, if you're in that way to provide us, with yeah, like this guy right here, um, <laughs> uh, Mexicano Zaibatsu. <laughs> yes. 
uh, donated seven hundred and fifty dollars. Wow! And he says, "Might as well chip in one more before work, roast some more." So he apparently roasted. has donated more than that. some roasteds and Twitch. Yeah, there. yeah. What a guy. Well, guys, you know what? It's like Jeff from One Step said. It's not about the big donation. Uh, you know, the ten and twenty dollars are, are how yeah. we kind of get there. But it is nice <laughs> to kind of recognize those big donations because it's a big deal and it's hype. You know? Yeah, it definitely is. Um, uh, there's a lot of really nice things coming in. Uh, I have a, a thirty-dollar donation from a toasty engineer who says, first time donating. Amazing what the TF2 community can accomplish." And it really is. It really is amazing. I mean, most of us here have been playing or have played before <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> when the game was uh, really in its infancy. And it's been so long now. I mean, I was thinking because I, I used to live in Chicago where we are now. And then I, I, mm. I moved. Right. Yeah. And I got married and I have a job. And <laughs> now it's like, hey, uh, you know, we're, we're here raising hundreds of thousands of dollars for a great cause. And a and game that's still kicking, still going strong. It's not just a community here. There's a lot of community figures here, a lot of yeah. community um, known faces here. But the community is out there. The community is you guys. Yep. Everyone putting in those 10 and $20 donations that's yep. helping us raise these funds for such a great cause. So the community is really all of us here. Mm -hmm. uh, we're doing it together. And if you're like me last year, you make one $20 and then you make a $50 and then a little later you make another fifty dollar and did you get a hat uh i i didn't win anything in the raffles last really? year i know i didn't but wow. i put like two or three hundred bucks by the time it was all said and done but it was fine it wasn't to win stuff yeah yeah that's a bonus it felt good yeah yeah there was no love lost if i win something it's it's a nice bonus but otherwise i'm still giving to a great cause that i believe in I'm two for two in the raffles both years and what an unusual. I'd you know, really? I'll see you outside later. So, uh, didn't you? Didn't you? you, know, you you're saying it feels good to donate, but it feels even better to win an unusual, <laughs> my friend. <laughs> didn't you? Um, Aren't Steph not allowed to? Didn't you pour raffles? out for uh, <laughs> Twitter followers? If you got a certain, like five dollars per follow or something? Yeah, that's right. We were. Oh my God! It was just like me and DJC were on stream and. I don't know, you're just looking for something to fill the air. Or like, I was I was just like challenging the other casters, you know, to dig into the wolves and get out the money. <laughs> so I believe you're on the Rado, Wall of Fame. A bit of a cheese mode, so oh, I was uh, like... Yeah, yeah, the first year, yep. $2 for every Twitter follower ended up like $654. <laughs> uh, that's not that's not active right now. Please don't go on my behalf. <laughs> we shut this, guy's <laughs> shut this guy's account down. Down, shut her down. Shut her down, man. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Put this guy's account down. You're still working on your get a whale impression? No. Uh, no? Not worth it. it. I know you have the, the <laughs> admirable impression. I've been doing impressions path. a little bit, yeah. 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 Cool. yeah. This is this is some hardcore medic contract getting done thanks to a team full of heavies. Because <laughs> I need heavies to get kills. Star, are you medic? It's perfect. Yeah. You are God. Do you know about contracts, Alex? Of course I do. You know about wow. the contract. Well, since <laughs> kind of embarrassing. Let me remind you. <laughs> <laughs> of course. See, Bear, do. do you know they have a second medigun now? Really? Yeah. Is it called the Kritzkrieg? <laughs> yeah. That's oh, wow. Critical. Critical Krieg. Yeah. Much like in Counter Strike, how you can um, buy a token mm. and partake in uh, like weekly campaigns to receive items. You can do that in Team Fortress. Now that's and that's where you see all these skins that are coming up. On I the like that. Stuff. I've been and the skins. We actually have a lot of uh, of cool skins, and I believe some unusual weapons now because there are unusual weapons of and we have are. some of those um, that you guys can bid towards. Just are showing how to be a proper medic here. What would you rate? Click on heavy. How would you rate your heavy's <laughs> performance of 1 to 10? He is he is pubbing hard. <laughs> Not hardly pubbing. Hard. <laughs> that that one life was 80 points in my contract. <laughs> hardly pubbing. Um, I have an anonymous $25 donation that just says the world is a beautiful place, and kids should grow up to see it. Keep up the great work. Here's to a great year of TF2 and its wonderful community. Thank you. Thank you. That's really generous. Beautiful. The whole skins thing, though, like the addition of uh, the kind of CSGO stuff, like this is going to oh, potentially, okay. you know, whenever matchmaking comes out, could we see TF2 getting that sticker money? Funding competitive teams is that the dream? Wow, well, are you listening? That's the dream, right? We want the uh, we start with a boon. Matchmaking was to uh, to uh, Counter Strike Go. Um, and the hope is that once we get it in Team Fortress and once it's fine tuned a little bit, because we yeah. don't know what the parameters are going to be, um, that it lets all the players like Mela and, and Tag there and Danny lets them maybe have a little bit more, get yeah. a little bit more from their competitive efforts. Blood Sire. Yeah, maybe you see a few <laughs> the, the, the returns coming back from the old. 
I don't know about that. Saying. Dust <laughs> off the dust off my microphone. Come back for a cast. Um, we're we've been sitting here when we started. I think just this hour or two hour segment, we were at like forty eight thousand or something, right. and we made the great announcement fifty. But we just passed sixty thousand dollars while we were sitting here. So God, I don't know if we're doing every ten thousand dollars for the clappers here, but yep. God. Nerds, can we have some clappers over there? Slow clap. I'm a nerd. Tag literally will not clap. He's that, he's I, I that just, much I of a gamer. I just made stir drop, okay? I made him drop Uber. <laughs> Look how hard he's clapping. Look how happy you are. That's what a everyone. Triode. Don't feel special. I got the drop. <laughs> I have to Uber a heavy, otherwise it doesn't matter. I gotta finish this contract. Yeah, okay. Nice Johns. Uh, nice uh, Johns. Are there Johns in TF2? Johns in all of life. There's a Twitch John. Yeah, that's too Yeah. Too bad he's not here. Yeah. The god. Uh, it's really crazy though. Just started, already have more than half of what we had last time. Yeah, John's already a beast rooster. You know, I, I was, it's weird because I'm, I'm looking, I don't have a, a total donation on this thing, but mm. there's, of course, we have monitors in front of us that have it, but every time you guys make a donation, as you can see in the top left, your donation pops up. And the, there's more often donations being shown than there, there is the grand total. So you look up and you're like, oh, hey, it's $10,000 more. Right, you try mm. to find the grand total and yeah, you can't get it for a while because you, you know. see the donations coming in. Right. I have another anonymous... Uh, that engagement. Oh, sorry, sorry. Another anonymous $50 donation um, says, I told my dad about this event and he wanted to donate. He's never heard of TF2, but his mother passed from cancer and his dad is currently fighting it. So thank you for the 50, you and father. And I think it's fair to say you. that cancer is something that has kind of, it kind of affects everybody in some way. We all right. probably know someone, whether it be family or friend, something like that, you know? So yeah, mm -hmm. I think it resonates with everybody kind of pretty universal, you know? Yeah, that's right. I think that's, you know, one of the big reasons why we see such a outpouring and, you know, the great viewership numbers and all the money that's being raised is yep. it's not just, you know, you like the content that we're providing, but it's also you feel that personal connection. And it all goes to one step. It's worth mentioning that. It's, yeah, it's goes, it kind of goes without saying, but yeah, there's not one cent comes to us, you know? Not one cent? Not one cent. I found a, I found a, a nickel. You have to give <laughs> that up. If you give me that nickel or you're going to be in some... <laughs> you, tall, you tall humans are going to beat me gonna up. going to stomp you down. <laughs> yeah. And the great thing about One Step, you know, in a, a lot of the events that you see and a lot of the donation drives, they go to curing cancer, which is necessary, right? It's yeah. important. Um, but there are people now who need, who need something, um, especially children, um, who deserve the right to be kids and to have fun. You know, as gamers, we want to have fun. We're, we're all a part of that. And when we can come together and do something like this that um, gives those children an opportunity um, to have something now that they can fall back on, to build the memories and the friendship um, and to yeah. feel like a kid, yeah. it's great. It's almost like kid networking. You get to sort yeah. of meet people that are going through right. the same thing and yep. or similar Support things. Support is such an important, especially for young people. Right. I might talk a bit more about it later, but I'm a survivor myself, and I was pretty young when I had it. And it can be really isolating. And so... Uh, you know, being able to take your mind off it is like, is so, so important. Yeah. And so, you know, having support groups and camps like that where you can just play and just, you know, do the kid stuff is so mm -hmm. sick and so great, you know. They get to go to camp and there's nurses and stuff there, so they get all their medical kind of stuff done. Mm -hmm. And then they get to be a camp. <laughs> yeah, it really, I, I think the video, I'm sure we'll show it many times. It's just, yeah, you can't watch that and not feel like, no. It's a great cause, and all the money goes right to them. Yeah. Um, I have a $25 donation from Roasty My Toasty. <laughs> the great man. Uh, it says, this isn't my real name. I just remember seeing it on one of Star's Aww. videos, and I'm sorry you have a target on your back, Star. This is a great event that you guys uh, have, and I can't thank you enough. Last year's pin was really cool, but I wasn't able to donate last year. But, yeah, so there you go. Some love for the stir. I'd say, like, 30% of the donations have something about stir. Aww. Yeah. Star. And not well, all of them are I nice. basically donated that money. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Star. You're the man. <laughs> no, no Star. Dude. If, if you think the pub is bad, just just imagine playing on this pub in default Team Fortress 2 settings. Yeah, I had to like, fiddle on, with the sensitivity yeah, a lot, and on. it's still really bad. You're not. You oh, can't. Just the no. sensitivity. Not the authentic you can adjust it. default TF2. What a terrible game. Like, and he's <laughs> <slow violent honor. laughs> I didn't even hear what he said. What did he say? Default TF2, what a terrible game. Oh, yeah, well. I would like to remind everybody that we do have that bid that's going to be coming to a close soon. Um, we have, we're running up against it, the North American versus EU Highlander match uh, will be casted by Admirable sitting right next to me and Sal, who's in the building. 
Um, but if you want to see where the server is located, or if you want to get to decide where that server is going to be located, uh, maybe give your, uh, your, your team a little bit of an upper hand, make sure you donate now and get in on that bid war. Again, once you donate, you can choose where you want your funds to go, and you can go right down right down most to the coordinated next, pub I've ever seen to the scroll box <laughs> and, and decide uh, what <laughs> bid you want to put that money towards as well. So yeah. Just get in on that way. And that's seven minutes left or right. yeah yeah it should be should be ending soon because we're coming up against and that's that. in addition like to enter in the raffles and whatever you also get to put that money to right. whatever it's, bid you want. Like right, so yeah, it's an addition. You're not just donating to decide what server it is. <laughs> it's just like <laughs> an extra thing. And it's, it's an a win win thing. you get to do. The backpack win -win. just full of awesome stuff including three golden pans which and there's oh, Valve merchandise yeah. too. I mean, yeah. you can see behind the players we have over there some uh, cool scout jackets. I that was hopefully, I'll get to wear later on. Yeah, <laughs> is that a donation incentive if, to uh, get you to squeeze uh, in? I don't know about that, but um, we do have a lot of Valve merch. They sent us a few boxes, so there's some Please. great stuff there you can put your money towards as well. Yeah, um, uh, I have a few donations to read off. $100 from Popero, Popper Zero, uh, wants to know to me to tell Tag that his wrist isn't broken. So Did you know that? Popero's wrist isn't broken, Tag. Popero? He's really. Papa Roach? Papa, I don't know. P E P P O P E R zero. Oh. <laughs> Thank well, you for his the wrist isn't broken. I'm hope I'm glad you're fake broken. that you care, but I mean th there was there I was someone in, there were no there was someone in my stream chat that was that messed up his, his wrist, but I don't think he goes by Papa Roach. Probably Papa Zero. Change his name. Name is different. Uh, Endgame eighty dollars says hi pals, super excited to see tip of the hats starting again. Thank you. Uh, fifty dollars from Admiral's favorite person, Sideshow. Sideshow. What's uh, up, buddy? He has a specific <laughs> ask. Love this community. What a highlight of the TF2 year. Heart. Beautiful people donating for a wonderful cause. Please polish Admirable's head, Bloodsire. <laughs> I want it to glow. <laughs> well, we'll get the wet shave going on later on, and then some, oh. maybe some... Uh, oh, God. Some Spit shine it. Whip it out. Here, here, here we go. Take a dying. All right, here. <laughs> Let's get, a, let's, let's get a little uh, buff that dying. Get sure some the, oil or make something. Make sure you get all that the that squeaky that sign effect. Yeah. Like, <laughs> maybe if you could perspire a little bit more, we could we could get it going. How's that shine looking? That is a too. handsome man. <laughs> Can we just give a shout out? Sal and Seabear are back in person. That's kind of a big deal. Yeah, that's pretty. Crazy. I think Twitch chat is loving that. Thank you. Sal and Seabear are, are not, not only but back, but here in person, and they're going to be cast in TF2. I did not know Make Sal was going to be here. I've never met Sal. Really? I love Sal. Yeah. Um, but we actually just got the word that we're supposed to wrap stuff up here um, and prepare for the cast of Dreams. It is NA versus EU Highlander. It's coming at you. That man is going to cast it with a ginger man out there that I haven't met yet, and I'm going to give a hug in like 40 seconds. <laughs> um, thanks to the pubbers for pubbing, and we'll be back and just a little bit here with uh, that official Highlander match. And if you want to donate to decide where the server is going to be played, if you want the EU to be played in England or whatever, and if you want the New York server, get your money in. New York, that. New York, make it happen. All right. Yeah. And I, I think we're going to we're going to shuffle up this area. So I'm going to be gone. Justin will be gone for a little bit, but we'll be back. Thank you guys so much. Keep donating. And yeah, we'll see you in a little bit. Be right back. Das. Thank you.